Star Wars Battlefront 2 are on Xbox Series X again, working towards <laughs> getting level 50. Uh, like the video so more people can check it out. Subscribing is cool as well. And I'm joined by... Kevin, Kane2222. And we're on the battlefront. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Which could on the infinite grind. On the infinite grind. It could potentially be the last battlefront time. Would be it. Ooh. It'll be retired? <laughs> I, I don't know. At level 50, what else is there to do? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, we'll see. I, I just figure with all the games coming up, it might be uh, out of circulation for a bit. Yeah. Not that we dislike playing, it's actually a blast, but. No. The fall is almost here. I'm not talking about the fall of the Jedi. Hello! <laughs> My point of view, the Jedi are evil. <laughs> oh, you surely are lost. You're downloading. What? Alright, I gotta like see the chat here. You got covered by this stuff. You're downloading Battlefront right now. Oh, cool. I'll hop in. Nice. I got sick internet speed. And we're all set up. That's not the window. Oh, that window. There we go. I should I get in at speed? It takes me like half a day to download this. <laughs> I mean, with the, the internet speeds in a gigabyte a second, get up to 2.5 gigabytes a second, you download this game and like... Oh boy. What's this, like what, 50 gigs? You download it in like less than a minute? Ha 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 ha! You know, like, that'd be sweet. Oh, we, yeah. uh, I mean, hell, the Xbox, I think, can only do up to like 600. You'd have to go buy a new Ethernet cord or something for it to get. <laughs> get like a higher bandwidth. Yeah. Then again, I don't even think like the thing can receive past like 600 megabits a second. I mean, I've just seen photos. I, I don't know what it's like. I've never come close to pushing my Xbox to its limit. No. <laughs> yeah. It's full potential. I don't. I don't think yours can actually do that much. I don't think that one actually is Because, you know, they, they have, like, limits, right? Like, yeah. Only do so much. I think the newer ones. I think the 1X and higher is, like, second. Uh, or at least I've never seen higher. Oh. Thank you so much for the donation. You have a question about Halo Infinite. Ask away. Always happy to sit here and talk about Halo. Halo. Yeah, when I say Halo, we kind of gotta go like, Halo. Like, like, yeah. Nice. <laughs> it's, you don't just uh, want to break into the theme song every time? No, no it's just <laughs> like, uh, there's this there's this uh, video called There's Something About Halo. It's on YouTube. Old comedy animation thing okay. for Halo. And it's like, uh, what do you mean it's over there? Yeah, Earth's over there. The little grunt's like, why would, well, why didn't you tell us? It's like, why would you be looking at that? And we could be looking at Halo, and then the, all the other <laughs> grunts are like, Halo. <laughs> <In the back. laughs> this is too easy, that's cute. And then the, the prophet just slaps the grunt in the face. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> and then they walk away. <laughs> uh, do you spawn with the grapple hook, or do you have to look for it? Uh, you have to look for the grappling hook. Uh, at, at least from what I played, the grappling hook is a pickup that gives you three grapples with it before it's used, but it seems to have a pretty fast respawn time. Now keep in mind that what we played with bots is not like official, uh, op like, it's not official like, uh, loadouts for the game, so the full game might have grapple starts, it might not, uh, I've heard competitive is BR starts. And you can see people on the map with the radar all the time. Whereas right now in, in the Halo thing, another thing that bothers me about it is you only see people on the radar if they're sprinting. You actually don't see them if they're just walking around. Which I think takes away a lot from the game. But in competitive, apparently it's BR starts with like full regular traditional radar. And hmm. uh, yeah, for the grappling, I don't think it's going to be a standard. I actually thought it was going to be. It's a, it's a bit odd that they didn't go in that direction because they were like talking it up so much. But I 
guess it would also be weird if everyone was grappling, but it's it's not a starting one from what I see. What's up, Kevin? I was actually listening to a couple buddies complaining about the grappling hook idea. You're running for a sniper and someone just grappling hooks it away from you. <laughs> I do that on one of the maps. I, I, I run, I race, I grab the grappling hook, and then I run by... Uh, this like rocket launcher thing called the Ravager, and I just like, you know, grab it from across the map, and then I just start shooting with it. It, it changes the game a lot. I doubt it'll be allowed in competitive play to be. Honest. People will complain. No. People will complain. Yeah. <laughs> like it's cool. Gravity Falls. Happy Falls. I think I've heard of it. Gravity Falls. Oh, Gravity Falls. I've heard of that one, but I haven't yeah. watched it. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, little Mabel character. She gets grappling hook, and she's yelling grappling hook everywhere. It's kind of... <laughs> oh. Epsi gave away you think of it? I've heard Ooh. Of it. Sorry, you, you think of Gravity Falls? Uh, oh, no, I was just laughing. Grappling hooks, all that. No, just... oh, okay. Uh. Yeah, no, like... It's, it's interesting, Halo. I keep trying to, like, glitch off the map. <laughs> but that's yeah. what I was doing. Because you can like kind of push yourself to the top of the map, and you can swing with it and kind of throw yourself over stuff, but they don't allow you to like hook on to things. They keep trying to like hook swing and then get up to a high point and then hook swing again, but they don't quite let you do that. I'm like ah, it's actually kind of polished in regards to all that. Cheat. Oh, thank you so much for the second donation there, Sanchez and La Cheeky. I want to say it's a fox, but it also looks like a cat. But at the same time, it could be an elf. <laughs> I think it's a fox. It's the mystery that makes it cool. It is. Oh, come on! Yoda killed me as, as boss? Broken. That was my short boss run. Jax is at work. I'm glad I answered your question. Yeah, it's, it's always cool to, you know, have questions about Halo stuff I'm happy to. Dive in there and chat about it. It's not a problem. I do like talking about Halo. Whether that's in a positive capacity or a negative one. <laughs> this is on the chat. Series X better engineered. Series X is very well engineered. Very good. How was my day? It was very busy. Very, very busy. I acted for like a few hours. And there's like skin missing. Throw <laughs> <laughs> up them calluses, bro. Not even calluses. It's just like missing. <laughs> like, like, patches are just, like, just skin missing. I'm like, well, that's gonna suck for, for playing games like you, buddy. And, uh, I did uh, went to the bar for a bit and ate way too much. That was, I'm like, oh, I'll try all their that's appetizers. That's always Because <laughs> they have, like, a thing where it's, like, you pay four bucks and you can try four of their appetizers. Oh, no, twelve bucks. Or what's it? What'd you get? 14 bucks? I think it's 14 bucks. Right. Or their appetizers. Uh, we got two pretzels, uh, offer chips or something like that. They're like all dressed chips. Ooh. Really good. I think an actual proper name for them. And a pepperoni, spiced pepperoni slices. Not to mention I had a burger there too. It was so like full. <laughs> Pretzels were great. They were actually like fresh pretzels. Oh, feast there, man. Was that at the Dogwood? Yeah, it was at the Dogwood. I got two beers, a hamburger, four apps that I paid. It cost me $30, and I gave a $5 tip. <laughs> nice. <laughs> that's, that's insane value. That's, that's insane value. Then, I filmed... A quick live stream of the Minecraft baseball. They have an MLB crossover map that they released today, so I did a quick stream for that. Because, you know, Minecraft stuff. Hella hot. I grenade. Yeah. Then I filmed a video for a mobile game that I need to edit for tomorrow. And now I'm streaming. Woo! What did she get up to, Kevin? Not that much. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Played Daisy. Went and got a Slurpee, that's the highlight. Yeah. <laughs> Slurpee? Where'd you get a Slurpee from? Oh yeah. 7-Eleven. Nice. Any cool flavors? No, nah, I just orange. I'm a simple man. Yeah. Simple man. Fights against the, the undead and other people and then... Yeah. 
the silent. <laughs> silent, but my god, I am just. I gotta go to bed early to get. Like, why do they gotta do? I know. It's such an odd time. It, it is, it's, it's like I said, it's always 7 o'clock usually. It, it's been like that for like five years. Screen movies, it's always 7. It's gonna be weird. At least excited for the movie though? Oh yeah, no, this one's got a great, you know, it's the Suicide Squad, it's got great reviews, everything's really fun and stuff, so. You know, I'm very, very intrigued to see what it is. I hope it's good. I think that's why they're doing screenings, because, you know, I, I didn't think that Warner was going to be, like, ready to do screenings. Like, yeah, Disney's the only one that's actually doing screenings right now, theatrically. None of the other companies. Oh, uh, did Warner do it? They must be uh, very confident in that squad to set up. That makes sense. Yeah, hopefully it does well. well I mean, Pull the CDC. Not a, not a lot of movies are doing very well because, you know, there's uh, the box office and not a lot of people go into the movies. And, yeah. And it's still closed in, like, the U.S. in some places. I just think that's... Numbers are not great. But, you know, it'll be cool to see it. Very excited. And my, uh, the, the movie guy, I like to meet. You know, because I haven't seen him in, like, a year. Because he, he always, you know, he did most of the screenings here. He would, like, run them and I'd... They've seen some stuff. I haven't seen him in like a year and a bit. Because we were joking, it's like, oh, you know, it's probably not good. This whole thing's just gonna blow over or whatever. And little did we know a week later that <laughs> <laughs> everything, <laughs> everything was getting closed down. And, <laughs> and then, like a year and a bit, year and a half now. Uh, That's funny. Yeah. We also need to check out. Some questions by people. I think I saw something where somebody was like, does this run better on the new consoles? So on Xbox, you can do the FPS boost to run it at 120 FPS if you'd like to. Uh, since it's, I think it's dynamic resolution scale, you get perfect native 4K. And, uh, hmm. I don't know if there's anything else specifically next-gen about it. I think that's about it. What more do you need? The Clankers want to know how my day was. I just said what my day was. I'm so tired. Yes. <laughs> the theaters are a thing of the past. I don't think so. I think theaters are all, will always be around, but I think the heyday of theaters and how everyone went to a theater is something that's going to change. Uh, I don't think theaters will ever disappear. It'll just be more... To go to a theater, it'll be more of an exclusive type of event, if that makes sense. And like a wealthy type thing. So like any I just always thought it's sad that people don't want to go to the theater just to sit at home on their couch. It's depressing. Where's the fun in that? <laughs> well you're spending go do something as well, like actually you know, get out. Yeah, you know, like you said, do something. Yeah. It's an event, right? You go out and you Let the sun hit you. Yeah. Get a little bit of socializing in, you know, be in a cool place with other people. Like like I said the one time, you know, the cinema is a very special experience. Like not much else in, in the world out there that humans do together in a collective all spot where they're all sort of feeling taking in the same like emotion uh, type of thing. I mean, we have sports, but I, I don't think they're quite the same setup as it. Not the same level of escapism as development. And uh, I will try to kill someone with bread. We'll try. Even though that's. Bring in that little bit of chivalry. No. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I forgot, we're in the second tier area, you know, like the streams more, people can check it out, question stuff great. So. Stop those damn clones from getting in here. Yeah, I thought we had found a new droid uh, chat line. I can't remember. Yeah? Was, but I, I think we found, like, a, I, I had come up with a new one that the droid said that I thought was pretty Something like that. The title is always confusing. It's a conversation starter. Yeah. Yes. These people guessing. Home built theaters? That's never going to replace uh, actually going to it. Unless you're a millionaire. <laughs> you know? Like, I went to one guy's home theater installing like his furniture setup and it was. <laughs> the whole wall was the theater. It was beautiful. So yeah, I could see owning that and not going. You know? <laughs> Yeah, but I'm just saying, like, yeah. like, a home theater for most people isn't, like, you know, 
film caliber, right? Like, it's not, like, the Dolby Atmos. The, I guess in the U.S., a lot of the theaters are pretty, like, run down. But here we've got, like, pretty, you know, nice theaters. Lining seats, the air conditioning, the seats, the Dolby Atmos, Dolby. I think they have Dolby Vision. I don't know if they retrofit those or not. Yeah. I've been to a theater, actually, since... October, I think. A long time. So that's a lot more recent. I think Endgame was the last movie I saw in theaters. So it's been like what over, well over a couple a couple years for you now. Yeah, that's a long time. Yeah, it's a while. Yeah. I don't think the Suicide Squad will be your go-to. Uh. I heard they fight the starfish thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like Starry or something like that. This big starfish monster. I don't know. Not to watch it. Uh, New York's going crazy. It's like an angry Patrick star. No, angry Patrick star. That's exactly what it is. How's this game compared to the old school ones? It's way more visually intense. Oh, I missed Boss because I was reading comments. No! Boss! I mean, it's it's a very different game. It's, it's not really any, like, original Battlefront, I would say. Uh, you know, I think the original Battlefronts feel a little bit more like Odd as this feels more like Battlefield. I think. You're destroying our stuff. What the hell is going on here? Our team doesn't believe hard enough. Are we missing players? Like I'm kinda like wondering where our squad's at. Let's see the scoreboard here. No, we got like a full team. I've just not seen anybody going over there. I'm gonna catch up on questions. Uh yeah, I do first person this game. Watch those wrist rockets, you know it. What's up, sexy sky captain? <laughs> you know how it is. Uh, free movie tickets for going and donating blood? That's a pretty good deal. We lose? Oh, I was about to be Bosk. That's funny. I mean, hell, the price of tickets these days. I donate blood for free tickets. <laughs> That's a steal. You know what I did? Uh, Cineplex during the pandemic. Uh, at Costco, they were doing like half price uh, movie tickets, so I bought like a stack of them. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I'm pretty well set. Oh, triple XP's on! The goal today is level 50. I am 48 and 60% to 49, so this should be easy. I hope your co worker is fine, Tyler. Hi there, folks, welcome. Endgame was like two years ago. Yeah, it was. Uh, they're not going to optimize this one because they, they're all hands on deck for Battlefield and they stopped support on this one because they said people don't uh, support this one enough afterwards. Excuses. No, I don't know. Yeah. We did take an L. <laughs> I mostly blame Kevin. Uh, you should. I guess. <laughs> no. What game do I recommend from Game Pass? I haven't done my monthly recommendation list yet, but I'm working on it, so that should be soon. I do have a video up where I literally go through the entirety of the Game Pass listings and, and suggest games, so I think that's your better bet than me sitting here labeling stuff off. Uh, you know, just for finding suggestions for different types of games. They are adding a lot of games this month. Because uh, it's like, uh, Codemasters got bought by EA, so they're adding a bunch of like racing uh, Game Pass because of they're being at EA Play. So, kind of cool. You like the Dirt series, about to be it back of new ones which is cool Hawaiian pizza I love Hawaiian pizza <laughs> do you like Hawaiian pizza Kevin ah uh, it's meh I, I probably wouldn't order it myself but everyone in my family likes it so it's my that. favorite pizza really I don't know I no. get to meet lovers every time I don't know how you couldn't have pizza without pineapple <laughs> <laughs> it just makes it taste so much less dry and it's got like moisture Better. I always get extra pizza sauce man. Maybe yeah because you need it because you don't have your pineapples dumbass <laughs> 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 Boo. yeah maybe uh, you, you should just embrace the pineapple I don't know try it next time you're like son of a if I wanted he was right. on a pizza I'd get a salad bro no <laughs> salad I'll get out of here uh, no. <laughs> Watch Talks 2 Gold Edition on the Summer Sale. Oh, well, that's a good deal. I think that one was pretty cheap. Uh, you'll have fun Watch Dog it up, especially with the FPS boost. 
who I know, the actress Kelly Preston. Uh, not off the top of my mind, but you know what I do know? That people should Ooh. like the stream so that more people <laughs> can check it out. Questions, stuff, great, donations, cool. Subscribing's awesome. Let's battle on Felucia! Oh, we're the clankers again. God damn it. I wish I could remember what that goddamn freak. Wait, that doesn't compute? You're under arrest? <laughs> uh, I think maybe it was like hands up. You know when they're talking in the elevator? Yeah. And then Obi Wan just like cuts them. What, what does the droid say? I think that was the line. Hands <laughs> up. Hands up, you're coming with us. It's like. It's like, like I don't know why, but uh oh, sticks out. <laughs> That's not the best phrase to, to yell at our enemies as we're going to work them <laughs> on the battlefront. Uh, droids are silly machines in this movie. They, they definitely are, but they're not like comical in the running at battle. They're comical if you get like two of them together. But as an army, they're scary. Why are the droids so comical? Did they like just get like a bad bunch of droids? Were they like service droids that they turned into like? Or oh, it was weird. I thought it was funny when like the Clone Wars movie came out. Like, I don't even know that they talked. Or like in Phantom Menace, they're all like, "Hey, that doesn't compute. You're under arrest." And then after that, when like the cartoon came out, they were all kind of cutesy sounding. That's true. All right. I don't know. Hmm. I don't know, I guess I'd have to rewatch them and actually like sit there and be like, okay, what are the droids saying? Back for Blood looks serious. Uh, I actually will be streaming Back for Blood this week. And maybe Kevin will be there too, what? Ooh. That one actually looks really cool. Well, people were asking, so I emailed my guy, and he's like, you want four codes? And I was like, okay. Like, what do you want them on? I'm like, Xbox. And he's like, okay, I'll send them to you. Okay, I'm like, cool. Very sweet. Oh, yeah. The Left for Dead replacement, however many years later. Yep. Hell, if we're not allowed to use Left for Dead, the name anymore, we'll do it ourselves. Right. <laughs> I wonder how close to it it'll be. It's pretty damn close. Like, I yeah. played the Alpha, like, it's pretty damn spot on. That's a good thing, man, as far as I'm concerned. One thing, though, is it's got, like, this card system. I don't know quite how that's going to... I don't know if it's going to be as mod-friendly. I think the biggest part of why Left 4 Dead was loved so long was because of the mod support. Whereas I think this is something they want to do in other games as services kind of thing with, so we'll see how that goes. Hmm. I mean, the pitch is genius. They, you know, they went to Warner Brothers, they're like, See Left 4 Dead? They're like, yeah, we made that. Okay, we want to make it again. Alright. New name, <laughs> same thing. <laughs> you got our money. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, uh, That's probably how the pitch went. <laughs> I mean, your last game didn't do well, because I was like, what, Evolve? That's true, but did you see this game? You want to literally remake it, but give it a different name. Sounds sick. I know, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Which one was even involved about, man? It was like, it was actually kind of cool, except there wasn't anything to it. It's like a cat and mouse game. Where you're, it's like hmm. four people, like four hunters, are like hunting this big monster. And the monster is like running away while eating. And then the monster eventually becomes something big enough to like chase the... The humans town. That's funny. Yeah, it just there wasn't any content to it, and it just like totally fell apart. Yeah. It is like Left 4 Dead, Back for Blood. It was married to John Travolta, Kelly Preston. I have to look into it. Probably know who that is. Coalition's next IP is Area 51 remain. You really want your Area 51, don't you? Funny. John Travolta? I mean, he's got some cool movies. I think he was more interesting as a villain. Except for, uh, what was it, Saturday Night? Fever? Is that was not easy. It's actually a very fascinating film about, like, 
out of a place they're not happy about and stuff. Dealing with a lot of like issues in society. Very fascinating. And then I heard the sequel is just absolutely. I didn't watch it. Where are the Skywalkers? I don't know where our Skywalker watchers are. This looks like something out of Grounded. Well, I, I mean, Felucia's like far older planet than the Grounded game. This is from episode. Probably even concept art of this that's older than that, too, right? And it does kind of look a little bit grounded. Okay, Kevin, your best, or not your favorite Star Wars film. Oh, uh. Should I do the or? No, should you do the or? You can only get one. Tell us why Phantom Menace is your favorite film and no less than 300 points. Oh, uh, Phantom Menace is the best film because Jar Jar Binks, so, um. Ah. <laughs> uh, that's actually a really good question. I'd want to say Revenge of the Sith, but I feel like everyone says that, so I'm going to go Return of the Jedi. I'm going to go Revenge of the Sith. <laughs> 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 Although, the best film in the Star Wars series is The Last Jedi. Ooh. Oh. That makes me, like, build up an aneurysm. <laughs> yeah. The theme... Or a movie with a theme of a failure and it's just so beautiful shot and so well done. Yeah. Best scene was the blue milk. I mean, it was pretty cinematic, but <laughs> I don't know, but they, they awesome. did a perfect thing. They took the character that had been basically completely jaded. Matt Walker, he's just jaded, he's just given up. He you know, in a moment of like regret, he attacked his nephew and he caused the destruction and death of all of his like done like Oh. Just been sitting there for dwelling at it at his mistake, and then it takes the the appearance of a new new possibility in the force, and takes that to kind of make him go. I need to change my ways and blah blah blah. Charming moment with him and Yoda that was just beautiful. Like, come on, that uh, you can't tell me in the theater you weren't just like tearing up a little bit seeing Yoda just pop out of nowhere and. Fun fact, didn't watch it in theaters. You didn't see <laughs> it in theaters? No, I oh. saw that first movie and I was done. Oh, <laughs> okay. Because that moment with the, the Star Destroyers, the theater just gasped when they did the, the Star Destroyer thing. You know, where they did the hyperdrive and it was like, yeah. and it was just quiet. The whole theater was like, oh. It was just, that was a really cool cinematic moment. And when he's like, you know, Skywalker's coming out, and it's like, all hope is lost, and then Anna, or, and then Luke's like, ah, time to get my shit together. <laughs> <laughs> and then he came out, and it's just, oh my god, it was so beautiful. Great movie. Mandalorian, it's, it's alright. Is my friend carrying me? Yeah, Kevin does all the work here. I'm just, uh, I'm just along for the ride. Chet, you betcha. No, I don't know. No, it's, it depends yeah, on like, the match, you know? We've done our team here. Like, come on. Uh, uh. Out here, give her all she's got. You're in the game and you're playing as Count Dooku. That's cool, man. This guy, Count Dooku. Oh, it's Short Bus. Yeah, he was here last night, wasn't he? Yeah, he's from Battlefield with us. Uh, what did he do last night, Battlefield 5? Yeah. yeah. Dunking on kids yesterday. Yeah, I think we did pretty well in that one. Jetpacker. Wait for next gen Battlefront. Yeah, that should be really cool. Come I think that would be like the next project after 2042. I'm I'm sure they've already done the artwork design for it. Already done like the uh, concept there and everything. And as they're done, they're, they're probably actually already developing it partly, and you know they just be polishing Battlefield. Oh, I'm preparing the post-launch content. This movie theater popcorn. Yeah, it was never huge on the movie theater popcorn. I like to eat it, but I always found that it made you really thirsty. I just always ask them to layer the butter. And yeah, that's pretty thing. good for it. Gotta have uh, it. Even I know that. I usually get the hot dog. I'll get a Stella and I'll get a hot dog. Nice. Yeah. I just I, I never actually DC. order anything else. That was to the extreme, I like it. I've always yeah. wanted to get something else other than popcorn, but I've never Big been ambitious dogs. enough. 
Like I said, man, just, just order yourself a beer or something's great. I totally forgot you can do that. <laughs> yeah. Right. Be an adult. <laughs> right? Yeah. Buy yourself a, you have a nice big Stella and hot dog and watch the movie. It's just, just beautiful. And then the reclining seat, enjoy the cool atmosphere. Oh god, tomorrow's gonna be a blast. <laughs> See, now you're excited for it. Right? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, do you think they'll sell beer that early in the morning? <laughs> right? They'll just look at you. It's like 8, sir. <laughs> yeah, it's like 8 and be like, I'm tired. I had to get up early for this. I haven't been in a theater in like a year now almost. <laughs> Give me my damn Stella. <laughs> Stella Artois. The Kenobi series should be good. When am I doing another flight sim video? Uh, well, we did flight sim the day there was a Tokyo tour, if you didn't see that. Uh, I do have another video set up for a London tour in a few days, depending if something else doesn't get pushed in front of it. Uh, I've got London filmed and another video that is Rome slash Naples. That's like a combo one. I, I went and filmed Rome right, and I was like, wow, there's nothing to this city. <laughs> like, seriously, it's like one stretch of, like, river, the River Tiber, and it's like, you see the Vatican, you see three things, you see the Colosseum, and then it's like, well, there's nothing else in the city. You're like, oh, crap. Because, you know, I try to make them, like, 20 minutes long, and I'm like, god damn, it's like uh, eight minutes of footage. <laughs> And I tried to like film up to the coastline. I was like, this is just boring. No, nobody cares about like the fact that there's like a McDonald's down there. It's like, what, what, what does this do? So, Naples is down the beach. I was like, oh, should just do the full European tour, man? That would take way too long. What? It? That's hilarious. Okay, so I I did a tour of Calgary and I missed like Spruce Meadows and stuff. Like I missed two spots and it took me forty five yeah. minutes. Oh really? Wow. Okay. Yeah, it, it, you know, it's, it's like a flying an actual plane simulator. Yeah. I mean, I could have used, like, a jet, but then I wouldn't have been able to be like, hey, here's this spot. Oh, you're just like, zooming by and everything, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that speck of land you might have saw two seconds ago. Look at that. My I just think if you ever do a tour of Saskatchewan, you could show them, like, two things, and it's basically the province. Oh, my <laughs> God. People were so salty when I did a Cross Canada tour on PC Flight Sim. Oh yeah? This little guy was like, it's so disrespectful, because I was like in Regina and I'm just like, they have a stadium and that's it. And then I left. Because <laughs> <laughs> you know, I got family from like, you know, Saskatchewan and stuff, and I just do not like care for that. That place is like, same with like Winnipeg, I was like, here's the arena, there's the city, it's done, there's nothing here. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it seemed like Edmonton, I was like, I think I excluded Edmonton, they're like, I can tell you're from Calgary, so that's why Edmonton was excluded. That's funny. People were just like, yeah, Calgarian, right? I was like, yep, and they're like, I don't blame you for excluding Edmonton. Yeah, I, was... <laughs> oh. I still think it was like a half hour. Like, I tried to get everything in Canada that I could in like a half hour, and it's just too hard to do that. It's just, you know... Vancouver, Toronto, Montreal, yeah, you're trying to get, like, something from each of the provinces. And it's just very hard to do in that time limit. Although Montreal is actually quite a, quite a beautiful spot to showcase. We might do a separate video for that one at some point. Assuming the tours keep getting views. As soon as they stop being Montreal would be neat. Canceled. What? <laughs> I think Montreal would be neat to see. Oh, like, we, we did it in the live stream. It was very, very lovely. Very cool spot. I can talk about it because, you know, I've actually been there. So. Not too hard to do on that one. And yes, the Stella is incredibly fun. But still, you're you're buying it for convenience and stuff. Here's good people are crazy. Uh, well, fiction. There's actually been quite a few movies for a triple to pretty decent in it. Oh, John, thank you for the donation. Wait for it. Uh, look at this guy. Gonna get your pilot's license soon. I hope you enjoy it. Still waiting on that nice. stream. I think we all are. Yeah. <laughs> we all are. I might do some of the, uh, they've got this, like, YouTube shorts that they're working on. With, like, mobile YouTube, so I might be doing some little quick video on their nature stuff. But... Hmm. 
beating on it. You can't like monetize. But they've got like a hundred million dollar US fund for people to do videos. Interesting. Which Travolta movie am I talking about? I just... <laughs> What's good, you know, just battling on the battlefront. But what is good, Kevin? Maybe some chivalry uh... that we did. Battlefield. Been a good week so far. Yeah. I think we had a pretty good stream for the most part. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah. Rally burgers makes a Montreal burger that ain't bad. Huh. I don't know where I've never even heard of that. Is that like a place here in Canada? Not sure. Why do we put PSO at five in the title? It makes people think. That's, that's all we're about, critical thinking here. Yeah. <laughs> really, really confusing. I, I love it. It's just the questions that come out of it, I think, are. I find them entertaining. Really? I can't get Bosk? I guess we'll be. Oh, then. Heartbreaker. Aviation license as well. Oh, I hope you guys are able to, you know, accomplish your dream out there and fly. It's cool. I mean, I don't think I would be able to. I mean, I probably would learn, but I don't think it's necessarily something that's for me. If I get at a point where I have lots of free time, I want to be a sommelier. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, why not? I like wine. I think it'd be cool. My one buddy who's in the Navy right now, he uh, has done a lot of piloting. And he was saying, like, it's super easy once you figure out what you're doing. I mean, it's, it's a vehicle, right? Like, it's a very complex yeah. vehicle, but it is, like... I mean, as long as you're not crashing, you're already doing better than Harrison Ford. Ooh, right? No. <laughs> Crashes often. Funny. I'd love to have Harrison Ford tell me to get off his plane one day. That'd be badass. And right. why don't you get <laughs> off the plane? Please. Whoa. Yo, hi folks, welcome. <laughs> Try it before you knock into this American fast food truck. Well, that's what I'm saying, is like we might not be able to get it here, if that makes sense. I was asking, I was like, is that even available here? Because, like, you know, we don't have a lot of American fast food spots. And she was like, just food. Like, the one guy, he's like, I'll send this food over to you. And I'm like, you can't actually send food across the board. If you didn't know that, Kevin. I think I've heard of that before. I never really understood why. Is it like, uh, because an allergy of, like, contamination with the food industry and stuff? See, we regulate our dairy and our meat a lot more than they do. Hmm. Uh, that's why there was a lot of pushback when I think Trump wanted to get his dairy sold here, is because our regulation standards are way higher than the US are for how milk is dealt with and cared for. Um, that's kind of interesting. Thing. thing with like contamination of like seeds and stuff into reach, it could be like uh, invasive you know, plants and that that because you know just because we're similar places doesn't mean we have the same types of you know plant growth and fauna and stuff so that's partially why yeah i wonder if you get something here that starts overgrowing or stuff like that nature's complex right you know the dandelion the dandelion <laughs> that beautiful flower from europe no yeah. species that's why it's a weed much of it I always like that. The difference between a flower and a weed is one's wanted. It was <laughs> wanted. That's funny. I think it's also rarity, isn't it? Maybe. Like, it's something you don't want too much of. It's a weed. Something that you want to get. Flower. Plant, right? Yeah. Because if I plant my lime plant in the ground, I'm not going to get 4,000 lime plants. I have the one. <laughs> Whereas you plant, like, a. Uh, Eat like a dandelion, you're gonna get a bazillion of them. Yeah. This is they don't have any competition. That's for the guinea pigs. Oh my god. I don't know if you know that, but guinea pigs love dandelion. Really? Yeah. You give them the leaf or whatever. I guess they like the flower too, but they love the leaves. They'll put their head back and the whole leaf will just like fly into their body. It doesn't even look That's like they're really eating. Cute. They just inhale them. That's actually really cute sounding. Yeah, it is. You gotta get like a whole stack of daddy lines because they just like tilt their head back and it's just whole oh, like big. Leaves Obviously, too. 
Like I'm talking Don't store bought dandelion leaf. Yeah, that's <laughs> just fun. that's funny. <laughs> yeah, they love that. They just they just go nuts for it. Oh, they, they love their greens. They love grass. They love parsley too. Par parsley's like crack for them. He's <laughs> <laughs> getting pictures losing it on that. That's funny. Yeah, <laughs> they're hilarious. Those things. Oh, you know what's great in my neighborhood? We got a bunch of bunnies. Keep stopping the clones from boarding. I don't know if it's great, but it's like it's just bunnies roaming everywhere now. Little little black bunnies all over the neighborhood. They're just. Pop in and it's like you'll walk at night and you'll see a bunny eating on the lawn. You'll be like, huh? I like this space. Never played Flight Sim once and immediately started looking up $2,000 hardware setups. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to the stream. Ever think about using a drone camera? I actually had a drone and it just didn't really work or go off the ground, so it was kind of useless. Metaverse, the internet is the biggest thing. What Star Wars? Yeah, I probably could maneuver an aircraft. I mean, it's just learning, you know. Something you, right? There is a concern that the Republic may have hey, all that U.S. regulates. Well, uh, the, the milk, the, our standards are higher for how milk is handled, and that's why uh, we didn't want American milk sold here. You can go read about it, it's like a big thing about the dairy thing, but Trump kind of pushed it through because he was attacking our industries. So, you know. But yeah, it was due to, to milk regulation. I, I don't think it's sold America, very well once it was here either. Hmm. I think part of the regulation is how we, the certain temperatures you have to keep the milk when you're like carrying it and storing it. How clean the milk is or something like that too, like just regards to like filtration of it. We have different, I just think different it would standards. be funny to have like a cup of air milk and like it's the exact same thing. No, I mean, <laughs> probably yeah. tastes very similar. Well, you know, all right. milk tastes a little bit different, doesn't it? Like different brands taste different. I've never really been anywhere else. Uh... Well, you can still get different milks here. I always get the purple milk. It's like two percent. I don't know the brand of it even. I just yeah, know it's the purple bit. capped milk. Actually, I haven't drank a lot of milk in a long time. I used to do chocolate milk all the time. I love chocolate milk. It was beautiful for, you know, it's a great sport recovery drink. I used to drink it with hockey and stuff. Probably commandeer a UFO. I did fly a UFO in that Fortnite game. So speaking of that Ariana Grande comp. Oh, is it happening? It kind of sounds like it is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited! <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's so stupid. Uh, that's funny. I mean, I'm still kind of waiting on like full confirmation, but it kinda sounds like it's happening. <sighs> In for it. On the live stream. What is life? Jeez, my turn got just humbled. Popular to hate on the U.S. I mean, we're not hating on the U.S. I'm just saying, like, this is the complexity of why that milk wasn't quite wanted. Like, we have very specific standards for, like, dairy products and stuff here. Well, I mean, obviously, they don't want competition, too, right? It hurts our farmers having, you know, competition, too. Do you think it's more popular to hate on the U.S. or Nickelback? Oh, definitely the U.S. No. <laughs> I mean, like, I don't want to sound terrible, but if I went to a bar and I was like, oh, the U.S. sucks, if, like, people would be like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, seriously, like, I'm not kidding. Not knowing anything about the U.S. Yeah, no. it's, it's not even, like, a joke or anything. That's just, like, how people would be. But then again, I mean, you know, you kind of do the same. You go to the U.S. and that. Because I went to, like, Mexico, and, you know, I was sitting at a bar watching some hockey with some Canadians, and then, like, the U.S. people came in. They were like, U.S., U.S., and they were, like, drinking and sloshing around. I was like, oh, my God. That's funny. Yeah, like, I had, uh... Housing a ruckus. <laughs> <laughs> I had a really good buddy from California, and uh, had an old high school friend that's another good buddy go down to visit him. And it was funny, my Californian friend told me that, like, he had a great time with him, but he said, you Canadians are so rude. He said that all we do is walk around saying, oh, this is better. Oh, this is better in Canada. Even though he was, like, they were showing him pictures, and it was, like, the exact same thing. Uh... But, you know, like, yeah. 
we, we definitely <laughs> there is a high level of smugness here that, that's for sure oh, total smugness man. a little smugness and i'm not hating on the u.s i just like i just remember going to mexico and i was just like oh my guys it's like four in the morning <laughs> <laughs> I just want to sit here and watch this hockey game. Yeah, right. <laughs> like we're just sitting down and they're like cheering and jumping around. And those, those are the ruckus. Those are the ruckus <laughs> chaps. <laughs> oh. Funny. That's funny. I always wish we had a cool chant like that, though. Oh. Cool chant. Yeah, we don't have any sort of like hype yeah. chant. Yeah. Hey. Just say you, uh, say, you, uh, say, I feel so I was just sitting there, yeah. just drinking my rum and coke, a beer, and it's just like, come on, guys, yeah. four in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> just trying to watch the juniors. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, God, so funny. Drink water. No, water's really good for you. I mostly just drink water, except for during the streams. I like to have, uh, I like to have my fruit. But, uh, well, I'm actually not even drinking tonight because I, oh jeez, this beer thing comes up. I went to the bar, so I'm just drinking water tonight. Huzzah! Good for you, folks. All right. And I like to drink fridge water. I'm snobby too when it comes to the water I drink. I'm sure I've told this story, but you know that might. Ex- your- <laughs> Did she <you> feel like? <laughs> you know, because I'm used to you know, I drink water. I drink it like you know it's filtrated through the fridge. And she like just it looked like she was going to the fridge. Because <laughs> you took the glass out of the cupboard. And then she just walked over to the sink and filled it and I was just like oh! <laughs> I didn't say anything, but I was just like <laughs> I was just aghast. <laughs> I, I talked to my, my sister about it and she had like a very similar situation years back too. It's <laughs> at someone's house and she's just like I couldn't believe they gave it to me like that. <laughs> you know, not... That's funny. <laughs> I was like, we're pretty snobbish about the water. It's like, it doesn't taste as good. <laughs> you know, because our yeah. tap water is pretty good here. It, it, it yeah. honestly is, but... I always just fill the cup up full of ice, and I'll do the tap water wait till it's cold. Not the same. It doesn't It doesn't taste as good, man. Uh, yeah. You gotta do the fridge water. You gotta. <laughs> it's, it, like, it'll change your life. You'll be, be snobby. <laughs> Never go back. That's funny. Let's go work on Petty. U.S. sure is winning a lot of medals. Although, the China. China is winning a ton of medals right now. I think it's crazy, but I mean, they got so many people. And then there's Russia. They shouldn't even be at the Olympics. You mean Team Rock? Yeah. Uh, Russian yeah. Olympic Committee. Banned four years, and then all of a sudden it's two years. Still there, wearing the same uniforms. Looking. How's yeah. that fair? If they win a medal, is it not for Russia? Yeah, seriously. I, like, I just keep looking and I'm like, this isn't fair. <laughs> they cheated for years. <laughs> and they got like a slap on the wrist. It's like, you know, Helen Timmy in the playground, you know, he cheated, but he, he can still p- race in the race. He just has to wear his shirt inside out. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, come on. <laughs> Everybody loves everyone. It's true. Well, it should be, I guess. Icelandic water? Try to ask Iceland. That would be cool. I think you got a similar feeling about that because I just like sit there and I'm like they're getting medals. I'm like this isn't fair. <laughs> <laughs> but, I mean it's like they work their whole lives. And they shouldn't be like kicked out because they're country. They should be like playing under like a nondescript team if that makes sense. Like it should just be like Olympic team. Be individual play, not representing any. The Olympic team, everyone. You know, like, like the Washington uh... football team. No, well, you know, sometimes there's like people that can't play for their country. Or don't have a country they belong to. Like, I think some refugees played under like a banner. You know what I mean? Like it's just an Olympic banner. That's what it should be. Hmm. For the full amount of time, they're not sorry. <laughs> Actually, I'm excited. I'm gonna go watch Men's I'm in soccer game. Oh yeah? yeah. See if they win it. Uh, it's our first time playing for gold and silver. That's very cool. That we, we beat the U.S. For the for, uh, so for context, this is why this is a big deal for Canada beating U.S. soccer. We haven't beaten it's them. It's never happened since <laughs> 2001. We've lost 37 games in a row to the U.S. In soccer. And we beat them. <laughs> and the one American gal was like, 
Who loses to Canada? I don't think we've ever lost to Canada. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. But yeah, we finally uh, finally get to play for gold and silver in that. I'm gonna go out and watch the game and everything. I think that's so funny to think of uh, America and Canada playing to see who gets to play for gold. Oh, well, you know, hockey oh, yeah. happens. Oh, yeah, hockey or something. Like, I could see, but like... I'm just like, uh, you know, it, it wouldn't be, like, none of our Canadian athletes during after a hockey game would be like, the U.S.? Who is it, who is this to the U.S.? Like, that would never happen, right? Like, Because <laughs> it's, it, it's, it is back and forth. It's competitive in that. Just think of the women's side. It's just funny. So yeah, we might actually, no matter what, we're meddling, right? So that's good. <laughs> but, win gold could be cool. <sighs> Is this the best Star Wars game? Um... Negative. Battlefront, <laughs> original Battlefront. Well, I, I like really like Jedi Battlefront style, or... Yeah. And I mean, you probably like Knights Steel Republic, right? Yeah, it would be my favorite. But they're all kind of like different games, right? And that's the cool thing about Star Wars games, at least for a long time until you got the license. There was so much variety. There's that's actually games. probably the saddest thing with the modern era is they pumped out Star Wars games when we were kids, and now, you know. There was like RTS games, role playing games, shooter games. So. You know, all kinds of different Star Wars games, flying games, just like we have nothing. Uh, I thought it was funny too for Marvel in that, that if that series had happened in the early 2000s, there would have been probably a video game for each individual movie and everything. Oh, we'd probably but be it's all... playing all the games for all the different characters at this point. They would be like cherished, nostalgic childhood right, classics. Equated to like one game. <laughs> Iron Man 3 is the best one. I have the multiplayer. Ooh. I mean, they did make an Iron Man the movie game, but we're just saying, like, going back even further, you know. Eight. Yeah. Let's see. Think about Canadian smoke. Forest fires. It's BC that's causing all the smoke. Yeah. Later in airports. No, I'm fine. That's... Person loves carrying coins. I like using the debit. Coke on ice is. I think Coke with ice is probably the best way to. By far. I think most things with ice is preferred. Except for maybe if you're drinking like an alcoholic beverage, you know, you don't want to distort the taste. Except for something like uh, scotch. I think the water actually ice and as it kind of melts actually improves the taste a bit. But, uh, you know, it comes down to preference too, right? Also a big difference is drinking something out of a glass versus like a can or something. Yeah. Yeah. BG water. Not even touching these conversations. Fallen Order is good. Uh, I did play Fallen Order. I played the first like hour and so of it, but I don't have time to sit there. So when I did my review or whatever, buddy Mitchell come and see how he played a lot of that. Yeah, you gotta remember, I'm not huge on the uh, the Dark Souls game. So it's something that is like Dark Souls. I go, oh, uh, yeah. Oh, John, thank you so much for the donation. Thumbs up indeed. For a fellow gamer YouTuber who talks about soccer and basketball. That's good. That's cool. That's fun. Soccer and basketball. Uh, I mean, I don't really talk about them a lot, but, you know, when the Olympics are going on, I love talking about the sporting event stuff. That's cool. Like, I mean, that's why you probably follow different streamers and stuff, as they do about different things, right? I'm assuming people here like the technical details, dream-wise. And <laughs> try sarcasm. You know, they have their reasons. That's <laughs> yeah, they have their reasons. I mean, I guess you just see different things here, right? Right? Oh, we don't just talk about one subject, I don't think. We talked an hour about Christmas, Christmas movies, right? <laughs> <laughs> we got a little bit of everything. Bro. That's that's one of the long-term highlights in the future. Like, I'm about the Christmas movie. Legend. In July too, not even like 
It's not applicable. I think that we, we did that in July, right? Stream was in July. Yeah. Damn these bots pissed. Football, football slash soccer. Oh my god, I always do that. So when I review the the FIFA games and the PES games, I always say the latest entry in the football slash soccer series. That way I don't offend any. Oh yeah, that's funny. Yeah, as I know it as soccer. I like to joke sometimes and say it's football, but that's just how we know it. What is soccer? I call it soccer and just inform everyone I'm uncultured. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh crap, it's Obi-Wan. Canadians are awesome. Oh, thanks. Yeah, I think we're pretty cool. I mean, I don't really have issues with the American folks. We've had our fun times. I mean, that's where most of the audience comes from, is the U.S.A. Uh, what's fun with sharing a border if you can't rib on each other a little bit, though, right? Uh, exactly. I mean, I think that's for any country. You gotta be able to joke about stuff. Uh, Oh, absolutely. I do have a couple American buddies, though, so yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, Very cool place. Oh, right. Here's the one who made the song for me. Right? Yeah. Long time. Always fun joke. Oh, that's... So proud of our soccer team. Right. <laughs> Playing in a place where everybody else calls it football, and, you know, they call it soccer, and they, they still somehow made it. All the way to the gold. I know, right? I just keep thinking that, like, I don't know, all the standard it's soccer countries, basically the rest of the world. No, they just other than they North just America would be the side of things, though. Hmm. Yeah, they are good for the girls. If anything, we're like these carrying women's. Canada right now. Uh, the women need to get better funding going forward. That's that's the one thing I've noticed is they because they're actually stuff. winning stuff. Oh, they, they kick ass, like... You got, like, what, one male has won a single medal for Canada? <laughs> and it's a bronze? Is, uh, yeah. I Good mean, for he's, him! He's the yeah. third fastest runner in the world, in technically, the world. if we go by Olympic yeah. standards, but you know what I mean? Like, like come on, guys! Uh, I was actually disappointed. Both of our beach volleyball teams got eliminated, and we like they were the world. One of them was like the top in the world. I was like, seriously, guys? Oh, that happened at the same time? Yeah, they got eliminated one after each other, match after each other. Oh, wow. I was like, are you kidding me? Not one of you made it further. <laughs> Amphis is a very lovely spot. Like eight Q times are still gnarly. I hope they get better. That's why they got all that funding for it. Football, football, not football, football. I like, uh, what was it? Ball's fun. Foosball? Oh, foosball, yeah. Go to a bar and do that, it's kind of fun. I think only bootleggers has it, though. You know what was really crazy? Uh, the Unicorn, they have... Shuffleboard? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's Shuffleboard. Shuffleboard. <laughs> <laughs> I'm picturing my grandma talking about Shuffleboard, you know, like... Well, the, the tagline of the bar is the place where your parents used to go, so... Oh, really? That's funny. Yeah. Got Shuffleboard so they got a theme and going Jenga. On? Block Jenga. They got darts, Shuffleboard, and big Block Jenga. At least in the top area. And they got, like, sand on the boards. Drunk people with sand. It's everywhere. I hate sand. It's <laughs> 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 across the rough. It gets everywhere. That was our 100th Star Wars reference. No. Yeah. That's 9.99. You keep that down, guys. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no Canadian males because no one can jump. Our swim is already in the U.S. Actually, we did very well for swimming. Uh, our swimming for the late team, they are, they are phenomenal. And very young, so next two, they're probably going to cash in. Cash in. I mean, as soon as the Aussies the are Australian gone. The Australian girls destroying? Yeah. The Australian girl, she's crazy. You know, talk about the US being swimmers, but my god, the Aussies. They gold, gold, gold. I think she's got three or four gold medals for swimming. <laughs> Hot damn, that lady can swim. And she's got a crazy coach that, like, humps the glass and everything. It's fantastic. Oh, really? <laughs> <It's> just <laughs> enthusiastic. Yeah. Well, I mean, Christ, they win gold, right? Right, that's funny. I mean, they, they do live on an island, right? Uh, if there's any place to know how to swim, Australia. The Island. 
No, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, technically, they should get swimmers in Canada because we got so many goddamn lakes here. Can't go anywhere without running into the water. Yeah, <laughs> not from Alberta. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. When they add esports to the Olympics, I don't know if they should add that to me. I just couldn't imagine representing my country playing Halo. It just would seem so odd at like an Olympic level. Like maybe there's the World Cyber Games, which is like, you know. It would just be odd. <laughs> John. Thanks, John, for the donation. He says, here, take my money. Thank you. I will take your money. I will. <laughs> I will. Probably get another monitor. So that my neck doesn't have an injury to it. <laughs> it's the monitor slush fund. I got a, well, and what is it? Okay, Tyler always is like, you know, here's some money for the uh, the alcohol slush fund, you know, for the gin. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, That's not cheap, you know. What was it called there? The man soda or something like that? The man soda. Uh, I can't remember. I thought it was the alcohol drink. I can't remember. It got called something on a stream once, and I just got a kick out of it. But heck, if I could remember, yeah. That's fine. I don't what it specifically was, but I can do it for every stream almost. I don't think. Well, cheap, you know. Probably killer on my liver. <laughs> I mean, it's not like I'm drinking a lot of it. Not a big deal. Hey, uh, Everything with uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Still relatively young. Yeah. Relatively young, but everything with moderation. Uh oh, how you live? The Aussie girls rock. Yes, they do, and she kicks us getting those golds. It is impressive. Boom! Ow. I mean, the next Olympics, three months away, and then we got another winter or summer one soon. Mm -hmm. Australia is an island, the whole world is an island. Well, I think they're considered. It literally considered. Like, I know it's a big landmass, it's a continent, but. I think it's still considered. Okay, you'd have to look at what the definition of what an island is. Then of an island, yeah. Because. It wouldn't really be wrong, it would be like. Two major. Three major islands? <laughs> I think it's like North America, South America is one big island. I, don't I think know it goes by landmass. Right. Isn't everything just a landmass surrounded by water at some point? That's Basically. I mean, you'd have to look up the Funny. definition of it. What's my man soda? I don't know what my man soda is. I'm falling through the ship. I don't know my man, so I don't know what you guys are talking about. It's three things. Drinking beer, swimming, and rug. Isn't that four things? Right. Oh no, drinking beer as well. Everybody's gonna I think. Um, most people. Most countries. Theoretically. I've seen some people bad at drinking. <laughs> yeah, I've, seen some people. I've got a drinking problem as the water goes all down. You remember that from airplane? Right. Yeah. Like, I got a drinking problem, and he tries to drink, and all the water goes all the way down his shirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's just that funny. Yeah, seeing that in theaters was such a joy. Yeah, that's funny, you said the movie theater was playing it one day? Yeah, Eau Claire, they, did, uh, they like to do old retro movies. That's cool. Like... My one pal Mitchell there, he's a big, he likes airplanes. The plane airplane you want to go watch, and he's like, yeah. <laughs> and we went. Ow. Ow. I will take your money and like it. Wait, wait privilege money? <laughs> oh my god. That's the easiest kind? No, I don't know. Thank you, though, I do appreciate it. Oh, these fight well. It is considered an island. See? I think I was right. We'll have to look this up. We gotta bring up like a big chart thing. Yeah? Because I've never not heard it like not considered an island. You know what I mean? Right. 
Oh, what was it? I think I remember in school there was that joke that it was the three. It was an island, a country, and a continent all in one. Yeah. Yeah. Holy hell, there's a lot of gunfire out there. They are holding these bays. I didn't even get the countdown and the guy was gone. What the heck? Garbage. I will not stand for it. How can you be a Jedi Master and not be on the counts? <laughs> <laughs> it's insulting! Never happened in the history of the... Well, seriously right. though, like... They must not have many Masters then, right? Oh, there's not many Masters and you know what? Okay, so you weren't a Master, but you were still on the count council at like your age. Like, come on, Anakin. Yeah, seriously, have some respect. I mean, even Obi Wan said uh, that. You know, it's never been done before. And he even mentioned, you know, your complaining about being the youngest guy on the team and not being captain. You know, yeah. like, come on. <laughs> Unbelievable. You're not Gritsky out there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Always have your support and love. That's that's great to hear. Their candy power. A, a meeting knows about what. All right. Don't quite get the reference. Hey, he knows about people who drink badly? You know, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Used to hustle people in foosball. Oh, that's cool. That's pretty. I like. I worked out with this one place where they made like wires. Like, this guy always went to pool afterwards, I guess, and he had like yeah. a special tiered pool cue that like was extendable and stuff. Like that. Hmm. I was like, you take it easy. I didn't work there very long. <laughs> it's like a summer thing. I don't even know why I was working there. Yeah, honestly, I don't even understand. I think it was an intern. I think it was just like a summer job to get to tell uh where to go into school. Nice. Back to it. It sucked. It was like, like renovating hard drives and really tell it wires for like irrigation or something? something? Yeah. Mm. Good to get a fire thing. Hard on the hands. Abby stabbies. Yeah, always so supportive people. Candy man move. Oh yeah, they've been making that one for a while. I think you're out the lake because of COVID didn't. Are they? Miss Kriba. Yeah, the, uh, what's his name? It's Appeal, I think. I'll say it's... Seems to be hit or miss on his horror film. Miss Kriba's walking in. <laughs> someone else balled him. <laughs> <laughs> they went down the path you can't go and someone else balled him down there. That's hilarious. How confusing these are ships are. He did like us. I didn't really. I like like the first part of us and the rest of it. I'm just like I don't get this. <laughs> but um, you know, get out. Obviously, quite well loved. What else did he do that was really? Yeah, I think he's put his name executive wise on some movies. You know, you know what I mean. It's like, oh, this person does this movie, but they didn't technically do this movie. They just slapped their name on it. He's yeah. Done that. Did I see the original Candy Bands? No, actually I had no idea what Candy was until I saw the teaser announcement for the new one. I was like, I've never heard of this. It has something to do with like wasps and bees and that, I guess. I mean, it sounds kind of cool. I'm intrigued. Interesting. Hmm. Yeah. You know, it's... It'd be fun, you know, like horror films are always neat, especially how they're reinventing horror films nowadays. Like, I love the new Halloween. That was really great. I'd, I'd love to see a new Jason film as a Friday. Although, again, the legal proceedings, I, they, I don't think they know who owns. Because the creator owns Friday the 13th, name, whereas Paramount owns Jason. That's <laughs> so funny, that's divided. Well, because remember, Jason wasn't in the first movie. Yeah, yeah. But, I mean, was he, was, his, uh, he was in it, but he wasn't like, yeah, uh, the copywritten Jason with the hockey mask. 
Yeah. It was just the mother. Well, wasn't the first? Yeah, it was his mother freaking out. And and he. But doesn't Jason, Jason is, jump yeah, out but... at the end? Yes, the but that's scene? not the Jason yeah. you know, right? That's not. That's oh, yeah. just Weird boy in the lake. That's not. Hockey <laughs> <Hockey written. laughs> Well, you know, it is that makes that difference between. You know, yeah. It works, right? We suck. I went back to the surface? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Watch the first, they won't be disappointed. Hmm, we'll see about that. Maybe. Chucky series? Chuck series might ruin it. Like, Chuck? I like Chuck. This is we're talking about something different. You know what Chuck is? Chuck, no. Like a nerdy guy's, like, uh. I was a secret agent or something, and it's got, uh, what's her name? Great. Uh. And they had to, they weren't getting a lot of money funding, so they got sponsored by Subway and they a Subway store into their like store in it. And it was just, it was, it was, oh, really? it was like, like a comedy thing. Like it's actually Happy pretty Gilmore? good. Like Gilmore? No. <laughs> I do remember quite enjoying that. And there's also uh, one of the best canceled, or not movies, TV shows I love is uh, Better Off Ted. That one's kind of fun. They work for like a soulless corporation where they do tech stuff. And... Yeah. That's funny, okay. <laughs> Yeah, that one's always considered one of the greatest cancelled for its time. All I know is that it's been a while, so be sure to like the stream <laughs> for more people to check it out. Yeah. Question stuff, great donations. Like, John just leading the way there. Thank you so much. Questions, great too. Why does every young and upcoming producer need to remake all the great movies? Uh, well, it's hard for an up and coming person to actually get to do their own content. Because, you know, there's a lot of money being used, right? A lot of money at stake now to make movies. So it's a lot cheaper for them to go, Oh, this person might be a good creator. But we don't know yet. So here's an idea. We'll give you this old franchise we have sitting here that, you know, used to make money. You revitalize it. We'll let you do what you want next, right? I never got with, like, movies. Like, you're saying, like, the issue is with that, that it's so spread out. Everyone owns, like, a different piece of the rights to it. And it's like, mm -hmm. why wouldn't you just, like, give someone the okay and make some money? Like, you're not making any money if it's just sitting there. Yeah, but you have the potential we all get a movie, to lose right? a lot of value in your IP if somebody takes your project. And blows it or something, does I bad guess. stuff with it or doesn't make it work mm -hmm. well. Or if they change things, you don't have control over the rights or you don't. Like, it's also about the amount of money you because you'd probably be mad if you made a character. See, the thing with the Jason character is the fact that, you know, the guy wants his money, the creator, and Paramount obviously wants to make money off of it, right? Yeah. And then it's the ownership of who owns what based on the, the loose rules of the character from back and, like, and stuff. And as, you, as the character's owner, you're probably sitting there being like, well, I want a, you know, I want a piece of this, and the Paramount's going there like, well, he shouldn't have any of this. Kind of a big fight over the characters, right? Funny we're all more. We, we all <laughs> want character more, just right? sits there. Yeah. And it's a lot of uh, it's a lot of like weird knowledge I have of like some of the stuff here, just kind of figuring out why some things can happen. Yeah. Can I play Rogue uh -oh. Company stream? I don't. I don't know. We might do Rogue Company at some point. Ten days left in Jason Voorhees. Guys, yes, we'll be doing a Friday the 13th stream for Friday the 13th. Don't worry, I've got that on my schedule. <laughs> Do you have that game, Kevin? <laughs> That's what we're doing. Yeah, that That's off Friday an awesome the 13th. game. I love that yeah. game. But, uh, you know, because August, it's Friday the 13th, so... Oh, really? This month? That's funny. Have I seen the Chucky Horror series? I haven't really watched Chucky. I've seen some of the movie. New Halloween movie looks great. The, the last one they did is fantastic. I'm very happy and excited to see uh, Halloween Kills and then Halloween. For now. Until they make it. It's the money. Halloween resurrected again. <laughs> the the re works. Lucky Horror Series. Would be a good game. I mean, Friday the 13th is... I feel like I'm missing that would some be kind of funny if you did like a Chucky game or something like the doll and you're hiding in the house and like it's you and like a couple other players and you gotta get away from this doll or something kind of creepy it works I mean I could actually kind of see Chucky end up in Dead by Daylight 
Yeah, right. I can see that. That makes sense. Yeah. This is a shame about those lawsuits because that Friday the 13th game could have been perfect if they adding DLC and stuff. I bought a costume pack last time we streamed it. Cause... Or there's something. Uh, maybe not. But... Yeah, that's awesome. I think I was debating it because the pack's like two bucks. Or... Like eight. For the... uh, actually, you know what? I don't think I could decide. And I, I decided not to because I was sitting there I was like. Because uh, we had talked about me buying one of the packs, and I couldn't decide between the sexy Halloween costumes or the sexy uh, <laughs> water suit costumes. I want to see a sexy Jason costume. Well, Jason doesn't get costumes. Well, actually, I think there's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was my thing. I was like, I honestly sat there for like a few minutes, and I was just like, I can't decide. Pondering. <laughs> I was like, the costumes, because I actually looked it up online so I could have image guides to kind of compare them. I'm, I'm like, huh. I literally can't decide between them. It's funny. <laughs> Xmas movies to watch. Chat can go over that. We've already done our, our Christmas movies. <laughs> oh. Watch The Grinch and Krampus near a fireplace. More like we should have The Grinch fighting Krampus. Ooh. Grinch versus Krampus? It's about time they start doing those movies. Let's bring Jim Carrey back. Right. <laughs> <laughs> this winter and holiday season, the Grinch returns. Ha who Doris. Ha who Horace. <laughs> 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 Welcome Christmas. Jim Carrey's The Grinch versus nondescript indie Krampus movie. Love it. Who will win? I'm gonna teach you the meaning of Christmas. Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. <laughs> oh. You kind of like the grown-up Cindy Lou Who. She's like in the. Right. Is she like in a rock band or something now? Is she now? I I guess she would be like totally grown up. Just, yeah. I think she sings the. Right. I think she's the lead singer of the Pretty Reckless. That's funny. Yeah. <laughs> like just like badass looking and just like I don't just know, imagine, Mr. Grinch. Like, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, she'd be on like the Grinch's side, or would she be the character that defeats them both in the end? You know, like... I think she'd be like the side character, and then Krampus would have like a side character too, and it would be like the B plot would be them battling while these two are battling. <laughs> <laughs> Attack the That's funny. <laughs> just like. <laughs> Ah, oh, Jim Gary was a good Grinch. Battlefront 2 after getting the level 50 achievement. That's what I'm working towards. I don't know if I'll uninstall it, but I think it might be our last Battlefront 2. <laughs> You'll just retire when it's done. It's when the stream ends, you hit level 50. This is what no, we've been streaming towards. Uh, you know, this is why we stream. <laughs> I would have never hit this achievement otherwise. Oh. But I mean, with all the new games coming out, it's it's gonna be pretty. The, the number of games we put back a bit. Yeah. Squeeze this in while you can, right? Mhm. Mm Probably do this again at Christmas or something. Yeah. <laughs> Festive streams of this that can't or Santa had. Yo, hi there, folks. Halloween. Halloween's fun. Let's see, Mia Khalifa, Merry Christmas, okay. <laughs> Are the demon called Krampus? We'll get them. Cake Mama on Friday the 13th? What's Cake Mama? The adult slash young adult honesty. Okay. I mean, some stuff I know. Some of the older things I know. Not everything. There's just too much to consume, you know? Ugh. I mean, I have watched all the Friday the 13th. I've witnessed them all. The good, <laughs> the bad, the ugly. <laughs> I'm quite excited they're going to be apparently doing 4K re-releases for the Universal Monster movie. I wanted to watch them, but I want to watch them like all together. If that makes sense. Get a marathon going? Yeah, you know like the 1931? Yeah. Classics. Apple Supremacy and Heroes vs. Villain. 
What game am I most excited for that hasn't released yet? Uh, you, you got one, Kevin? Uh, 2042. I might go. Yeah. Can't really think Literally of trying to get the new console specifically for that one. You know, so. <laughs> That's the one that gets you going. Yeah. I got that 128 players. All right. I think I might be most of... actually. You know what? I'm pretty damn hyped for Psychonauts 2 this month. Yeah. Yeah. That one is that's a game of the year caliber thing. What I've played of it. They gave me like a six hour uh, like preview play of it, and I'm like, this is, really enjoyed it. This is really good. And now, Double Fine is Xbox first party. Ha 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 ha. Have you never. You ever know what Psychonauts is at all? Or? No. I haven't actually heard of it. The 3D platformer where you're sort of like an agent, uh, agent find people. So the whole game is about jumping into the brains of different people and experiencing things. Jack Black does like some. Hmm. Nuts. But it's just like a psychedelic drive and run because you know every brain is like a different world yeah and kind of neat sexy ass kind of neat idea i don't know if i could do dracula you can dress up for your halloween stream my halloween stream maybe yeah i could do that do buckaroo bonsai fun. i love that one <laughs> one of the mumbles were dracula for halloween yeah, I, I did. That was one of my favorite Halloween costumes, actually, I think, was I needed something last minute for, like, a Halloween party that I last minute got invited to. And I was like, I can do Buckaroo Bones, and I've got, like, a blue dress shirt, I've got the tie, and, you know, I can do it. <laughs> <laughs> and I did, and I was like, huh, I actually kind of look like the character. <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. That's a bit odd. I had to explain to some people why. Actually, one person knew who I was. My bu my buddy Mike there. He he actually knew who I was. I was like, yes. He's like, you're pretty damn accurate too. And I was like, yep. <laughs> I like those costumes that everyone's like, what? I don't know if you've ever seen it. Really obscure cartoon, but super jail. And I went as the warden. Yeah, I mean, no one knew who I was, but me and my girlfriend knew. So I had a blast. <laughs> you get to explain it. That's a nice talking point, especially if you're trying to meet people. Yeah. Because I could be like, well, here's a picture of what he looks like in the movie, and they're like, oh, yeah, no, that's pretty close. And I'm like, yep. Like that. I wonder if I can pull that up on Instagram. Let's take a look. So I took a picture of it. I was like, oh, yeah, I was pretty proud. Oh, Anakin's in there. I don't know where he went. I just, like, walked by the thing, and Yoda was chomping down on it. That's not good. They are all running down Central Hall. They're yelling something about being for the Republic. I don't understand. <laughs> Last I checked, they were part of the First Galactic Empire. Oh god, there was a funny thing where they were making fun of that Star Wars quote where it's like, My allegiance is still locked or something. I can't remember where that was. Oh god, so funny on Reddit the other day. Yeah, you ever There's seen There's a lot movie? of memes based off of the prequels, man, and they all work really well. Endless, endless amount. Just like this whole various combination of stuff. I can't remember what it was, the application was. You ever get that? You even get a funny thing, you're just like, forgot what it was. <laughs> Yeah. Like, you have the memory of it being funny, but you don't have, like, the context for it to be told as being. Okay, they are still coming down that hallway. Oh my god. Fortnite competitively? It's cool that you play that competitively. You did the cat in the hat last year. Nice. Started Psychonauts 1 on Series X. It is legit that game. Still holds up pretty well. Uh, they did actually, so I actually got to talk to Tim Schaefer, that's his name, Tim Schaefer. Uh, as part of, like, checking out the game early, I actually got to sit there and do a dev talk with him. And I asked, are you guys going to do a remaster of the game? Uh, he said, 
Uh, they actually would like to someday, but in order to do so, none of the original like source material exists, so they'd actually have to read all of, like the cutscenes and stuff. I thought it was interesting. I'd be a lot of work, no? Yep. Like making a new game, basically. I mean, you don't have to do all the work of like, you know, coming up yeah. with the game and stuff, but you know, like you're basically starting from scratch, right? Oh, John, thanks for the donation. Can we give it to you? Give it to your co-host first of the stream today. Good stuff for free. This. <laughs> there you go, Kevin. He's totally liking your stuff. Love He's liking it. the co-host, and you're throwing out here. Some appreciation. God. It's about time somebody mentioned Kevin out here. But, yeah. <laughs> Nobody spams Kevin with messages. He only told me he got one spam message from someone. Only I thought one. that was funny. I was all like weird. Yeah, it was after doing the first Kingdom Come one with you. So it was like, are you the Kane 2222? And I was like, what? <laughs> and I, looked, what? I saw he was on YouTube and I was like, oh, I wonder if that's what that was. Like, I'm actually surprised you don't get more messages. Like, I'm not, not likable. No, I'm just playing out. <laughs> like, years from like Minecraft. Like, I like that. Or are you saying it's like, do you know Sky Captains? <laughs> like yeah. that? Oh, like, uh, yeah. Yes, my, I know. My one US yeah. pal, he was always like, they always try to use me to get into chatting with you and stuff. And it's like, really. That's funny. I don't think I'm that big. It is hilarious. Yeah. He's like, I know what they're doing. <laughs> I was just like, <laughs> oh. <laughs> In South Park? That's interesting. You were a prisoner for Halloween last year. Literally a prisoner. I mean, I think some people do like the whole, oh, I just miss Bosk again. They do like the traditional, isn't that a traditional outfit? Is wearing like the, you know, the, the prisoner outfit? Oh, that's not good. Somebody joined the chat. That's not good at all. I don't know who that was. Invite only, my bad. You're lacking today. No, I'm just fine. Did <laughs> any audio come through? I don't think any audio came on that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it was definitely gonna keep on that you cat in the hat. That's cool. I don't think there's bots in the ship, is there? No, it's just us. No bots in the ship. Yeah. People trying to fail to understand each other. <laughs> no. Competitive multiplayer? I actually, I was in a circuit for uh, years. Four. I think it was Gears before I did competitive circuit. Very poorly, man. Not happy about it. I was <laughs> doing doubles. I actually went and competed at the Microsoft store for like. Oh, did you? Yeah. That's neat. Yeah. You want to know how I qualified? How? There, there was no one that showed up for the qualifiers, so. I Love it. By default, it's still a win. Yeah, and yeah. I <laughs> faced off against the New York <laughs> Gears of War store. Or the, yeah. You know the New York Microsoft store, and uh, they had zero ping. Oh no way! Zero, like like literally number zero because New York is like the central like, you know that's where those, the server stuff is or whatever. And it was like they had zero yeah. ping up. And then we started late, and there was like disconnect issues, and I was, I was very very displeased with the setup of that. That's funny. Are you ready for round three of being on the ground or four? I hope not. Are we really going back to the ground? Yeah, yeah. Are you bloody? How long has this match been going on? I don't know, actually. Well, I have streamed Fortnite in the past. We usually do a review when we can check it out on a new platform. And it's looking like we might be doing the Ariana Grande costume. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm looking forward to. That's... A cool ass to developer. Yeah, like if you know, it's, it's neat. See, I, I get that inside stuff. I, I get cool details like that. I didn't bother him about bad jokes. I knew he wouldn't. Do I still have that list of things? Let me see. I've got like a whole. Oh crap, where is that? Oh, here we go. Uh, old voice actors returned. Read up, remaster, remake. A lot of the source material doesn't exist, such as the cutscenes. They'd have to do that from scratch. It would actually be easier to do a sequel than doing the first one. The acting holds up. Someday Schaefer would love to do it. 
it would be easier to do a sequel. Wow. That's when you know it's. Uh... Yeah. <laughs> ah, that that's what's an issue. But you know what's not an issue? It's liking the stream so that more people can check it out. Yes. Russian stuff, great the nations. John, <laughs> super generous today about that. And subscribing is awesome as well too. I think. You know, we're not, we're not getting to 100k anytime soon. My, my timeline to hit 100k, slow down, man. It's, it's May now. Mm -hmm. May, May 1st. May 1st. This, but then once you hit 100k, it's got to be for 150, right? Like, the goal keeps going. <laughs> well, I mean, you get the plaque, and I don't think you care too much at that point. You get to, or something. That's funny. Oh, they don't give you a plaque for like 200,000 or something? Uh, you get a uh, 100,000, and then you get one at a million, and there's one for 10 million, and I think if you get under a million, there's another. Just... 100 million? Wow. Yeah, you can read up on it. You get a custom plaque at one point, and then it goes back to being like a ruby plaque or something. But like, YouTube reaches out to you and asks you what type of plaque you like. And they work with you to make it. <laughs> that's, yeah. well, that's interesting. So you get the the silver play button, and there's the gold play button. Let's, no, what they do? I look this up. Oh, the building part of Fortnite. Oh man, I just can't do that. Hmm. Yeah, the, the building part of it's hard to do with. So legit, I feel like, yeah, you know, the Psychonauts, uh, like, that game is actually, like you said, well, well acted, well uh, voiced. Button. YouTube creator buttons. YouTube awards, no, it's play buttons. Let's see. I used to have a graphite and opal one. Oh, interesting. Those are the silver ones. The silver is 100,000 subscribers. Gold one at a million, diamond at 10 million, custom creator award at 50 million. And then there's the red diamond creator at 100 million. Ooh. I mean, I'm just trying to get an extra 31,000 people or something. <laughs> it's not asking for much. No, it's just... no, no, this is just, you know, a small town or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> uh, love it, yeah. Uh... 100 bagillion plaque. I don't Rookie know. numbers. No, Rookie I don't know. Numbers. I'm sure there's a certain point where you just kind of keep getting subscribers. Like, and it just grows and grows. I don't know. It's like really That'd be crazy. Like, like 100 million? You got like I know. more yeah, followers in most so countries. Much. Like, <laughs> that's crazy, man. God, I mean, we can edit the HTML on the page, and I... That's oh, 100 million, there we go. Alright. I don't know, it'd be cool to get. On Mesa, old channel, about 3k. Oh, that's pretty good. It's hard to get subs. It, it is. Gravity Gun from Half-Life was added to Fortnite. Seriously? Dying Light 2. Well, we'll probably be covering Dying Light 2. Yeah, you know what's funny? So there was like, you know, you know how I was complaining about that tweet about that guy that sent that out there? Yeah. I actually emailed them in today to tell them I wasn't in. Oh, really? Yeah, I, I said I respectfully declined the code or whatever. Think they'll lose any sleep over it? No, but I mean, if there's enough people that can or send in a message about it. Yeah. You know, from a PR standpoint, it looks bad. And again, you know, it's like not like I make a big dent or anything, saying you know something. But no, that's a good point. If you and everyone else took that stance, you know, like gotta get the ball rolling somehow. Are we hacking them again now? <laughs> Are, Are we? Gonna we? Lose? Holy. <laughs> Are we gonna lose this? <laughs> Fortnite. What's my favorite candy? Uh. I'm assuming we're excluding chocolate. Right? Why would you just go chocolate if you could? I don't know, I feel like it's different than candy, isn't candy more like... I don't know, like a chocolate bar is a candy bar, is it not? Candy bar. <laughs> 
I don't know, I think a candy I should really just play five cent like uh, I just go sour patch kids. Maybe like Skittles I don't know. Skittles aren't bad. I don't have a good one for that. <clears throat> I am as impressed as my programming. You use party chat instead of Discord? Uh yeah, yeah. The Discord. It allows us to pipe in the audio easier than Discord does. <laughs> and Discord kind of has a lot of like audio issues I've noticed. Recording and stuff with it. Ah uh, yeah, we chat. Party chat actually sounds Ah, uh, for Right, I'm ready for a new map, man. Like, <laughs> oh my god. How many times have we gone up and down? Like, seriously. It's gotta be more than an hour we've been doing this. We've gotten a two-hour match. It feels like it's gonna be a two-hour match. I don't think we're gonna break this. But you know what? Well, we can break the YouTube algorithm system by liking it. <laughs> yeah, some more people can check it out. <laughs> Special stuff, great. Donation skill, like mentioned, Tom's being so generous tonight, which is wild. And subscribing is great as well, too. Yeah, you know, I'm loopy. I'm, I'm loopy and tired because we just we go up, we go down, we go up, we go down. <laughs> Man, what my favorite was yesterday when we were doing the battlefield fighting, and you're like, you know, but what we are fighting is the YouTube <laughs> algorithm. <laughs> <laughs> Great line. But that was pretty good. Okay, I, I maybe we got this. You break them down. Joydy tries to roll in the back. Is there one you want to focus on? I'm dead now. Behind you, behind you. I, I think we're doing it. I, th I think we got this. I think we're finally going to leave this godforsaken planet. The planet? <laughs> thinking like Cortana and Halo 4 and she's like I will not allow you to leave oh that really blew up this planet we blew it all up we did it the dark side wins Roger 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 taste the rainbow sure why not gotta go well thanks for hopping in what you could oh my god that was that was brutal and if we ever miss comments in the chat, don't be afraid to re-ask or whatever. Woof. That doesn't get me to level 50. No, shit. <laughs> <laughs> XP. Let's see, how much points did I get? 80,000 oh score? Boy. That's it? No, never mind, I got 132,000 score. Jesus Christ. Okay, I, I know it might sound Got into odd, the 100 kills. But, but next match, I should hit level 50. Nice. This is it, guys. This is what we've been streaming towards. The magical match. That would have been crazy if you hit it all in this one match. You had 164 kills? Eliminations? We would have needed to go up and down like two or three more. <laughs> wow, my buddy Rogue almost with 200. <laughs> Christ. Like I had 300 eliminations. I know they're not kills, but like, damn. Yeah. Damn, man. That took forever. Oh, comment guy loves us. That's great. Thanks, comment guy. We love Ultra. you too. Yeah, much love. Am I tired? I'm always tired. <laughs> I need some sleep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's why we're not streaming late tonight, guys. I gotta get up early again. It's the, like, I spent, like, a few hours kayaking today. I'm just, like, beat from it. And the sun today was, like, 30 degrees. But you can't tell it because of, like, the forest fires. Oak. Right? It actually kind of killing my summer a little bit, too. The beginning of the summer was so beautiful. And now, ever since Stampede, it's just smoky every day. Mm-hmm. Just smoky and stuff. Yeah. I mean, I put suntan lotion on because I didn't want to get burned again. And it's just, like, it beats you doing all the paddling and just. We went far, like we saw a whole chunk of the lake there. Cool. Yeah. I saw a, a like group of geese in the water. There was a whole like it was like families of geese. 
Nice. Have any non OP superpower? What would it be? What kind of non OP power do you want, Kevin? Uh, meals for free. No, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I feel like the know, ability like... of persuasion would be helpful. Persuasion would be good. Yeah. But what kind of power would be, like, not OP? Like, growing your fingernails long, you know? Because, like, even persuasion, I'm just thinking, if you had the power to just persuade anyone you ever wanted, you could be president of the world, you know? Yeah, but somebody could just, like, shoot me or something. Yeah, but what if you persuaded them not to? <laughs> You'd still have to talk to them. And, like, you know what I mean? Like, I somebody could just, like, yeah. sniper distance. Like, that or being incredibly charismatic would be very helpful. You know what I mean? Persuasion, you can persuade people. You're very charismatic, you can just, like, sweet talk your way through life, right? Yeah, I guess. I always thought, like, the Magneto power controlling metal, but I guess that would be very overpowered. That's very overpowered. You know, yeah, you know, like... I just think it's something cheesy, like, people have to pay for me. I walk into something, people, someone's just compelled to be like, hey, I got that. But... <laughs> I got that. The bigger question is, can we persuade people to like the stream Whoa! so that we're yeah, looking <laughs> Uh, you know, I think we just did the chat, so I won't layer it on again, but I, I felt like it was a missed opportunity. <laughs> There's anyone for something, anything for someone to get, could it be that subscribe? No, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> the ability to make women like you? That's depressing. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. I'm sure eventually you'll find someone that likes you. I sure didn't have that in junior high. No, <laughs> yeah. There's a guy over here. Have I checked out Call of the Sea? Uh, I think I did, but I didn't have to do it. I wanted to review it, but I was doing everything else at that time. Uh, acid spit. That seems very unhelpful. Bullets, short <laughs> shorts, tank tops, and jet skis. What? <laughs> <laughs> I just like your what? Yeah. When do I start my streams? Uh, when do we usually start? Like an 11 MST usually? Yeah, about that. See? For those late nights. Yeah. But I mean, I did a very short Minecraft stream. I'm kind of testing that instead of playing a Minecraft map, filming it, editing it, uploading it. I just quickly stream them during the day and I just get them out there. That's funny. Yeah, that Minions video I did's got like, what, 30, 40,000 views doing that technique. Really? Wow. Oh. Craft Minions, man. It's my money maker the last month. I did Minecraft this week. I need to do more Minecraft. And it's those good kind of videos, because you know, Minecraft, you get the kids watching, you can do like an ad every like 10 minutes, go pop, 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 pop. But <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that one the, the Halo streams was fire. People wanting to check it out. Yeah, the Halo. A lot of excitement for that game still. Yeah, which is good. The next flights I'm going to be covering those, you know, those in depth later. Like, but yeah, think about minerals. Hi Obi Wan Kenobi. Hello. I need sleep. Everybody says I'm tired. <laughs> right. I'm out here giving it my all, trying to do a stream oh. here. <laughs> I was like, get some sleep in there. Yeah. I was up till like, what, the six or something, editing and getting that video ready. You know? That okay. was funny. Yeah. Doing chivalry and all that. Yeah. I love that game. <laughs> it's a lot of fun. Yeah. My god. Darth Vader breathing. I'm tired. No, it's... <laughs> <laughs> but it's not the right era, Sky Captain. No. no. Funny. <laughs> look at like me, look at me, because you have fun. That's fun. You pretend pretended to pre-order on Amazon. Oh, the back for Blood Beta. <gasps> I get to be Gosk. 
Nice. Everybody watch out. That's <laughs> Flosk number one. I mean, I ended up getting... Well, I will be getting some. So we'll be streaming back for blood this weekend. But be prepared. I wonder if I can rope my buddy Mitchell to join it. Get the full squad going? That'd be Get fun. Get the full squad going. It's gonna be a lot harder to Is do it four-man teams again? Yeah, it's four-man squad. I ran into Anakin Skywalker. Of course I did. Oh, he ran away. He hates sand. He must hate Geonosis. I never thought of that. It's more <laughs> dusty. Is it like dusty? Dust. Okay. Yeah. I don't think it's really Dirt. sandy. No, that's actually a good point looking at it. I don't know. Well, wait, wait, wait. in the movie, isn't it sandy when they go over the... You know, it looks more like oh, Mars than, than sand, yeah. right? Like... I can't tell if it's dirt, but it has that, that like rolling like sand. sand look. Yeah. When you're up here on the up rocks on the and hill, stuff, looks like dirt. This doesn't look like. It's kind of like an outback kind of thing, you know. If you were going to like Drum Heller, it's kind of like that. It's like a bad land. This guy is juking me out, and uh, that's funny. I messed up Yoda pretty badly there. Lines and stuff. Pinch on the back. Oh, Yoda, come on. He came back up there. Have a good day. Thank you, comment guy. And you're more 2 30 where you and you're more awake than I am. I mean, I'm usually up <laughs> to like whatever hour doing stuff, working on these videos. I act all day. Went to the bar and people are giving me a hard time. Come on, guys. <laughs> like, honestly. How do I feel about Subnautica Below Zero? I'm supposed to do a stream on that, or I was supposed to do a stream on that a long time ago. Got it to review. I was busy. So, we'll have actually eventually do a stream for that. I'm also going to do a video on Paint the Town at the review, and the guy gave me the specs for that game. Me? Hmm? Me? I need. Oh, and somebody sent me like a fishing game. I tried to get Riley to rope in and do it, but it's too. <laughs> Got real rogue responsibilities here. Right. Oh. He was my fishing guy. I had a fishing code. Off dude. What was that one uh, you got him to try? I don't know fishing World Tour. Was good. Dovetails fishing. Yeah, World okay. Tour. I think it's on Game Pass. I don't really played that one for a bit. I, I would like to be clones. <laughs> huh? I would like to be clones soon. But you don't like doing like an hour and a half straight of just like the same map, but being Separate, yeah. all the time. <laughs> all right. Uh, there's a lot of dead left for dead clones on Game Pass. Well, I mean, I wouldn't say there's too many clones. There's like what. Uh, ever is it Everfall? What's, what's the one of the the aliens that they cover? Not well, Earthfall. That one's a clone. I think that's my game. What else would be a Left 4 Dead clone? No, I don't think World War Z. I was thinking World War Z. I played that game. It's fun, but it's not it's, really Left 4 Dead. It's Left 4 Dead ask, but I wouldn't say it's like a Left 4 Dead clone. I don't think would have yeah. lots of Left 4 Dead clones. Left 4 Dead is like a very specific form. You know, like... You know what actually would be fun is playing Left 4 Dead 2 on PC and on that like Minecraft mod. Or... Oh, that's, actually... that's funny. <laughs> Tear down to Xbox Series X? Heard of that? That would be cool. I don't see a Minecraft witch looking like... Adorable, you know, like non threatening. <laughs> not threatening. I mean, Minecraft stuff's pretty creepy, man. They, they do a good job with like zombies. It's a very well done mod. Very, very well. Full conversion, like, you know, it's like a. What do they call them? Act? It's like a whole act of Left 4 Dead act. You go through the five different areas. I think it's five different areas. Yeah. Very good. Vermintide? Oh yeah, you're right, you know, Warhammer Vermintide, very much a Left 4 Dead clone, that's very true. Very true. Great game though. Very great game. 
Paint the Town Red. I'm, I'm looking forward to playing that one, like I said, because people are asking about it. So I asked for it and I got it. So just downloaded it today. That one I think I can get done. You're in my game, my beast. That's good to hear. Welcome to the battlefront. On the Xbox, you pretend to be sick to, know, to stay at home and play it? That's nice. Should we keep the <laughs> Halo Infinite Flight app installed for future flights? I would suggest you do. Um, I mean, you probably have to update them anyways, but it's going to be easier to just have the game update itself than reinstalling it every time there is. And it's it's small, it's like 20 gigs, so you know, it doesn't hurt to just put it there, right? Yeah. And let's see what else we got here. I like Fortnite. And I think we're caught up on that. Weed Puller. You know, you, you make fun of Weed Puller Simulator, but there's actually a game coming out this month that I want to review called Lawn Mowing. Lawn Mowing Simulator? What? Yeah, you, you get like, they had a demo for it not too long. It comes out this month and it's got like authentic, like, lawn mowing equipment. Like, no lawns in it. <laughs> and it's like Xbox Series X optimized and everything, and it's like <clears throat> next gen lawn mower. I think that would be cute. See some parents trying to get their kid to look, mow the lawn. He's like, after I'm done playing my game, he's playing Lawn Mower Simulator. You know, <laughs> <laughs> oh, that'd be funny. I don't know, this is, it's different. I love covering right, yeah. stuff like that. Oh, the well, that's why I got to be boss, is because everybody's boarding. Oh, that sucks. Didn't realize we were boys. Okay, fishing. hopefully we'll send him back down like two more times. No. <laughs> yeah, two more times. Goat Simp. Goat Simp's fun. It's stupid, but it's fun. I'm missing one achievement in that game, and that's for doing that stupid, uh... What's that stupid old mobile game everybody left where you're like a duck or something going? Flappy Bird? They got like Flappy Goat in it. It's the last achievement. I can't beat that Flappy Goat. Drives me bloody nuts. I clicked A. I clicked A. Where's my boss? Boss, come back. In my heart, I want to be a lizard like you. <laughs> what is good? How was my day? I was, it was a pretty tiring day. What's good? We're just we're on the battlefront. I'm hitting level 50 tonight. What's happening? Doing it, guys. Long awaited level 50. Yeah, we've streamed like, I want to say 10 times this game. And this is what we've been like riding toward. <laughs> yeah. This is why we do the battlefront. So proud of this one. I'm gonna make room for us to play other games. I'm not sure. <laughs> pressure washer simulator? That actually might be fun. I like watching, they call it like pressure washer porn or whatever, and it's just these guys cleaning things with a pressure washer and it looks so clean. <laughs> it's amazing. Really quite impressive seeing pressure washer at work. Uh. I have a main. I should make a taking out the garbage simulator. Garbage line. I mean, there's a lot of sims out. Yeah, if you don't like carry it out right, it breaks open on you, and you gotta go get another bag. It'd be funny if you <laughs> had to like pick it up, put it in the bag, tie the bag, but you break the bag, and oh, you put too much in, <laughs> right. it just falls apart. Yeah. Yeah, be Garbage bag simulator, feel the rush. Yep. And and garbage. Out. Yeah. Quite some the quote pull quotes on that one would be hilarious. There are a Lushing couple games that. like that. I remember asking my cousin, what do you play? He's like, oh, truck simulator. Truck driving like or something like that. More of a European. That's funny. It's huge. Like, it's a big thing. Watching it dubbing. We did win that long ass map. Yeah, we did. Yeah, that was, that was a hard battle, but we did win. I don't know that I have faith in this one, though. That was... <laughs> I mean, I don't really want to be on this planet again. So. Right. <laughs> Do I ever rage while playing games? I mean, probably sometimes. 
Not on stream, no. <laughs> no, not rarely on stream. I was getting pretty pissed at that, like, die at the end of every hour. I was like, god damn it. Oh, really? Yeah. Frustrating as hell. I was like, how are you supposed to do this? It was like cheating the game. I, like, I don't think it's really mad math. Yeah. Daisy's that game for me. Because you work so hard and you die, and it's like, oh, I'm going to spend like the next 45 minutes just trying to get back. Like, I don't know if I rage at it, but definitely like, I feel frustration, dude. When you die and stuff, it's like, oh. I feel like more. Right? I feel more exhausted by it when I'm just. On it just took this long to do this, and it's always something stupid. I like getting caught in the doors. <laughs> God, I hate getting caught in the door. You ever get caught in the door, and it just like it's like a glitchy yeah. door thing, and it's like you can't move and you're getting hit, and you're like. My oh. favorite is you're in the middle of combat. You both start shooting, and then the zombies pick you. Oh yeah, because the zombies they make right. a choice, right? Yeah. I... They lock onto you too. Look how that's determined. There's a mathematical equation for it. The bigger threat, then I'd feel actually quite flattered. No. <laughs> yeah. On mowing simulator, I think it's pretty funny. I, like I'm actually looking forward to doing a video. I think it's gonna be hilarious. This is lawn mowing simulator on Xbox Series X. Fresh cut lawns. Okay. Do that saying. line just perfect. Yeah. Uh, I'm already ready for it. Lawn care. Lawn care. This is lawn mowing. <laughs> Looking forward to the Samsung Galaxy's Unpacked event. Oh, nice. Old 3. Uh, good for you. Uh, I got emailed from Google in a while. I need to get my... I got my Google Desktop video review, which did okay, but I got to do the written part of it still, and it's been so long. Too long. Because I'm kind of hoping I end up with... Uh, I'll review the people, hopefully. Did I hit it? Oh come on! We got it was such a short game. I only got forty thousand points. The hell, Kevin? How far are you? I'm like seventy five percent. Damn one good long match. Come, come on, damn. clones! <sighs> I feel like it would be appropriate for you to get it on like Hoth or something. Cool. The cold planet, old like my yeah. heart. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Bad lulls over here. As you can tell, Battlefront's always a hot, hot. Hmm. Are you getting the four of the Republics? No, the Skywalkers aren't here today. Ooh. They're usually always here to support. Our worst. Hoth. Hoth would have been, been myself off. if you pull it off. It's, it's the map we're on. No, it's Hoth. But I want you to get your 50 on this. I don't know. That's oh, you were I'm saying that. For. I thought you already yeah. knew you were loading on the Hoth. Oh, no, no. That's funny. Uh, That's map we're going on. I'm quite unaware, me. No, it was <laughs> quite unaware. Anyways, guys. It's Hoth. Be sure to uh, like the stream. Question stuff great. Donations cool. Subscribing's awesome. So uh, let's get that level 50. Yeah, we might not, though. It might be too fast, right? I've got the ton ton. Like, was I just not killing last match? Like, I thought he did all right. Cause we lost. Oh, they killed me off my ton ton. Womp is the fastest way to earn XP, but it's not as fun as battling. Right? We gotta, we gotta earn it in the battlefront. Not the battlefield, cause that would be. All the very. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh come on. I thought I had that guy. Defense? Wave defense? What? I mean, what we doing? I mean, I, I think it's okay. Do what you do, you battle, you take the plan and stuff. Is this the way? You know, they just finished filming the Book of Boba Fett, and I guess they're starting filming the Orient. Oh, really? Cool. I thought they were the same thing. Yeah, I, that's actually funny you mentioned that. I thought it was going to be like a season three of The Mandalorian. 
Although I have no idea how they're see filming season three of the Mandalorian season. When what's his name is out here in Calgary filming The Last of Us. Who? Actually, you know what? He doesn't do a lot of the scenes, does he? That Pedro Pascal. Yeah, he's in the helmet a lot, right? Like. I guess that's how they're doing it, probably. When yeah. is this Mando in the helmet? Is that him? Or most is that time, another it's guy? Not. It's not? Okay. Yeah, most. Probably saves a lot of money for them. But, uh. Yeah, he's, he's out here in the city. Last of us. Which it would be really cool if I eventually get, like, a call to do, like, a cat or background actor. That would be neat. You said you signed up for that, right? Yeah, so yeah I signed up for it, so I never hear back. I mean, I probably won't. Yeah, still worth a shot. I mean, they're filming for like a whole year, so you don't know until you randomly get like a yo can do Oh crap, there's too many of them, Tauntaun. Get me out of here, Tauntaun. Tauntaun, go, 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 go. It's like a horse that just won't jump. <laughs> oh, they got me, Tauntaun. Go. Planning on watching any of the new movies coming out this weekend? Uh, well, the reason we're streaming, and I'm... Streaming early and stuff today. Gotta get up tomorrow. See a screening of the Suicide Squad, so I. Technically, I'm seeing. I think that comes out this week, right? That's it, yeah. I'm not too sure. I know uh, the girlfriend was looking up uh, times for it. She's excited for it. But you know what it is? Just come back. It's another. T it's another DC movie. <laughs> I mean, the reviews are really, really good for it. That's why I liked uh, when they did the digital review screenings and stuff, was because it was kind of like on even playing ground, if that makes sense. Like, I could review at the same time, so like LA would get a screen on the head of us. No, it made it really fair for reviewing things, and I didn't have to go to places. Someone doesn't just get to check out someone else's review before yours, sort of thing. Well, that, that's how it works for movies, right? You gotta live in like, LA on the third two, three months. Like one time, I, I you know, I, I had to tell what's the Lionsgate. I'm like, I'm not from Cali, so stop sending like review things because I'm like, I just can't, you know, justify flying out there. Although I should have. Uh, I mean, I wasn't making it, but you know, they were like, you come fly out. I think it was. Power Rangers and John Wick I should have done it for. I could have went out and saw that movie three or four months before it came out and did a Q&A with like Anna Reed and stuff. Yeah, I would have been really cool. Yeah, I should have paid for it. I don't know, it's just hard to justify spending that much for like single review thing. I mean, there might be a time where that's both of me. I was just like that. That is really quite an amazing offering. Though. Should have went and done it. Seven player kill streak. Playing the Death Trooper is like the way to go. Oh, those guys are shit. Ah, oh, it got me. This nice squad does come out this week. Well, I hope you enjoy it when you go to watch it. Fave scary movie. Favorite scary. One, two, uh, three, four, five, bro. <laughs> right? Um, scary movie two. Uh, scary movie one, man. Uh, what's up? Uh, no. What's up? Uh, I actually like the scary movie series more than all the horror movies they parody. <laughs> that was <laughs> And we haven't had parody movie theaters. I don't think you could really do a parody movie 
get her anyway. That was a funny age. You remember like superhero? Actually, I liked superhero. I, was, I still I go back and watch them. I mean, some of it's stupid. Yeah. Where he's like the dragon fly and stuff. <laughs> a terrible. <laughs> Just trash. It's got like a young Kevin Hart in it. Leslie Nielsen's in it. Maybe that's why I like it. Like this dumb looking kid. I don't even know what like what the actor is. Right now. Seen him in nothing else. But... Dragonfly. It's like they're making because they're making fun of, of Spider Man One in that one and other superhero films like X Men and stuff. When did that one come out? Oh God, like two thousands. Like <laughs> yeah, it's not old then. Long time ago. Suicide Squad. The thing. The things are really good movie. The All Thing's the actually yeah, one of my favorite horror movies. It would be a horror movie, right? Not a sci-fi? What, The Thing? Yeah. I'd say it's horror. Right, yeah. Uh, no, I really like that one. It's just funny with those movies, because, like, Aliens, it, or Alien and Aliens, right? Like, those were horror movies, how they started. But to me now, I kind of see them more as, like, sci-fis. Especially nah, the second one. Horror. The original is. Original. Too. Yeah. Oh. Third or three? Mm. Don't like the third one. No. I know, but still. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Keep in mind we're in Canada, so we don't get HBO Max, so we don't get day one. We have craved because Bell likes to screw us, not only on our cellular, but also on our loot. Yeehaw! Bell ever wants to work with me? Thumbs up. That was. I'll do the commercial. Bell. Canada's best cellular network. <laughs> <laughs> Thumbs up. Uh, well done, Sir Weinberg. With I, I never like reading your comments. It sounds so good. He really <laughs> describes it like it's usually when I'm hungry. Right now I'm not hungry. Like I, I wait, wait. But like. It's just like you know, whatever hour of the night you're streaming, he's like, Ah, oh, I made this and this and this, and I'm like, God damn, starve in here. It's like it's descriptive too, it's not like it's just like, Oh, I had a burger. It's like, I had this scrumptious burger with these sauteed onions and special peppers on the side and crispy right. fries that are wavy. I sat there and the air was perfect as I whiffed the fry. <laughs> 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 uh. <laughs> it's just a little That's funny. funny. Uh, Sounds great, like the food though. Definitely always does, but it's just kind of like I'm usually starving at that hour. Oh. Talks about amazing food. The Shining is really good. Oh, The Shining. Okay, I quite like watching this. Yeah, that's funny. Like, I'd usually say I don't like the horror genre, but when you point out there are good horror movies. Good movies in almost every genre. Yeah. Except for apparently. Yeah. Easter movie, of all things. Easter movie, yeah, it's like nothing. Nothing, really. But like... Yeah, no, it's, there's a number of real. I need some... Was delicious. I bet it was delicious. <laughs> That's funny. He always makes the craziest food stuff. <laughs> yes, no, it's not really good. Although I was very happy with my fries and the lager the pretzel and the crispy flavored pepper. <laughs> we want to go to the dogwood, man. Especially, you're telling me you got all this food, a couple beers, and you're like, yeah, 35 bucks with tip. Yeah, the tip is like <laughs> bucks or something. 18%. Right, like. I was thinking it's like, you know, I could go to Atlas or be that much for like a mini jug and their sound. Yeah. And it's not as good. It's just not. I'm actually like I'm set up to go to Atlas to watch. Where the 
the game, right? The football. I'm actually thinking of yeah. talking to my friend about moving it else. But I, I don't really have a ride there, like the... Too far. A nice meeting spot sort of thing. Hey, victory! Like an on-the-way kind of spot for him. <sighs> we won. But did I win the personal goal of level 50? Ooh. <laughs> did I? Faya God, I think you're the tier on YouTube that gets a monthly gift, so I think that should be up on the channel. You know what the gif is, uh, Kevin? You know what that is? The moving image thing? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's a that certain tier they get. Oh, we didn't... I still didn't get them, like, 85% of the way there. Oh, no way. Yeah, the one member tier I do a monthly gif for. I think I've, I filmed that today, so I get up and stuff. Exciting. If you're in Canada, you pay with coins. I mean, you, you could pay with coins if you wanted to. You'd need a lot of coins, though. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I very rarely use, like, you know, physical currency these days. Very rarely. I did buy my PS5 with physical currency. That's how I always do it, I don't know. Yeah, because I had to meet a guy and pay for it in the middle of a negative 30, 40 winter storm. Wow. <laughs> I, I needed it for work. I got one earlier. That's guess, commitment, but... right? <laughs> well, I was like, the guys got it. I'm like, because uh, I was, you know, the pricing was going down for the PS5s. You know, they were like going lower and lower. And I was like, okay, this is an acceptable extra amount to pay. I was like, I want it. He's like, you sure? It's like a storm everything. I'm like, I'm not waiting for you to think about somebody else you're going to give it to. I... <laughs> no. Leg? I'll have you know we haven't dropped a single frame this live stream. Oh, no, not a single one. The only Phantom Menace here is you. <laughs> no. <laughs> is Kevin... That was a Star Wars burn, kids. Star Wars <laughs> Is Kevin still thinking on establishing his own channel? Uh, theoretically, one day, who knows? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I, I think yeah. of uh, the people that, like... I have come in and do stuff. Joelle is working on her own, and Mitchell has one that does like does rock climbing. Oh really? Yeah. Uh, I'm just. I join in. That's what I do. No. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'll bet you that. Yeah. But you know what? I help people do. Ooh. I, I encourage them to like the streams. More people to check it out. <laughs> Question stuff. Great donations. Cool. Subscribing. Yeah. That was not my smooth. I had something, but no. It's all good. You're yeah, working hard today, man. man. Everyone can hear it. No, fell flat <laughs> on my face. Everyone can hear it. Come up. I mean, I think tomorrow we should. I'm gonna edit that one. I don't know how well that's gonna do. Is a search for you know it's it's weird so it's like it's a mobile game I got that I'm covering. When that when a mobile game it's a game that's on other platforms. I do like. You know how do you do that? Yeah. Because you know if somebody's searching for something they're already searching for the other version. But do I put like X game mobile gameplay or do I put like iOS gameplay? It's just oh god. I think you should throw Xbox and PS5 in it. That's what I was because <laughs> I bought from a scalper. You're damn right I did. I get paid like a hundred bucks extra. Nice. I definitely got my value out of it. Certainly no regrets. I mean, I wouldn't have been able to find one otherwise. A hundred bucks for the PS5? No, a hundred over. Oh, hundred over. Okay. I was like, whoa. <laughs> like what? Six, seven. It's fifty. I think after tax and stuff, we figured it would be about 100. It's not bad, though. <laughs> no regrets. I wasn't able to like, secure one. He did. Paid for it. All right. Not with my life. It was some hockey parent who was like, I don't need the two of them, you know. I thought my kid would want. 
He's very nice. He wrote up a receipt for me and everything, so I can use it as a write-off. <laughs> <Ooh, nice. laughs> <laughs> it was like this is a big thing, because you know when you when you're buying a console from someone, you gotta make sure they have like the original receipt. You gotta yeah, you, know, you gotta be smart about it, right? That's funny. Can you write off consoles on your? It's, tax? it's work equipment, so it's like you that's write off hilarious. Of, yeah. You, you can also you can you can choose to write all of it off, or you can carry it forward into <laughs> for future years. And stuff. It's, <laughs> it's so sweet. I never really uh, thought of it that way, man. It's, yeah, it's work equipment. Yeah. Just five worth it. Can't wait to try Ratchet Clank. I think you'll really enjoy Ratchet Clank. It's really cool. Very next gen. Feels very good. Also, iPhone destruction video meta. I think they, some people still do the destruction stuff. I think the funny thing is pe people do the destruction video and then they don't get like many people on it. It's just, that was a waste. I mean, if you got money to throw away like that. <laughs> Finally get to be an Ewok. Uh, we buy like the best part of the whole walk is the thumbnail, but I, went with the... I wonder what the photo looked like. Was it just like them blowing the horns in the trees or something? <laughs> it's just like a big Ewok standing there with like a spear, like a stabby spear. It was pretty cool. It was like it's an Ewok, but I don't know if that would resonate. It's all fun in games till the trees start speaking Ewok. A wee <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> Ewok hunt put them into perspective for me. I always thought like cheesy, but then when this game gave that description and like, yeah, that would be freaky to be trapped on a planet with a bunch of man-eating teddy bears, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Anything's cute and cuddly till you make it deadly. Alright. No, I got the Ewok here. Okay, 550 after taxes. Here you go, see? Oh my god, my Ewok just got smoked. God. I mean, it depends on how much you're willing to do on that server. Yeah, as long as I didn't buy from some soulless person or something, I guess. Alright. Anything, it looked towards, like, it went towards some kid's hockey or something. Whatever. Probably just bought McDonald's with it or something. No. Yeah, probably. <laughs> I don't know. He had, like, his kid's hockey bag in the trunk and everything. I don't need to hear about the stories. Get this transaction done. It's, like, with 30 something. That's all. Yeah, yeah. You ripped my box too, I just Like I see it, it in there, really you really open it up all the way. I wanna make sure right. you know what's in here. I was like, no, no, just Christ. Should have just came up to you in a trench coat, like, hey kid, you wanna buy a console? Oh, yeah, I'm the blizzard. <laughs> <laughs> Back for blood, yes, we'll have a stream for Back for Blood this weekend. Did get the code for it. Had a friend get a Series S yesterday. He had to drive an hour to get it, though. Wow. Uh, VRR Must is nice. amazing. It's definitely worth it. I highly suggest getting it. VRR completely changing. Kevin, I, th I think you just got to get your Series S online. It's probably a bit. Yeah, it's starting to look that way. Anything, so. I just obviously don't know it, but I have that feeling the minute I'll order it, it'll be like, oh, yeah, no, it's available at Walmart now or something like that, you know? <laughs> I, I, I don't know. Just... It, like, I haven't seen Probably them not. Yeah. I've looked around. Cause I like to see them in stores, right? Yeah. Yeah, I remember. I found destruction. People would buy a 360, smash it up. Well, I mean, you know, those are videos where they pay for themselves, right? Like, there's the one guy who does the tests of the iPhone scratching a screen, but he probably makes so much goddamn money off of it. And you, know, you can rebuy the phone, like, several times. The destruction videos are kind of stupid, and they get angry about it, but the guys are, like, cashing in on them, right? Right? It's actually funny, I wasn't too big on them. I saw a couple of those, like, I don't know, joke videos or something where dudes, like, walks up to his PS4 and stomps on it, and he's like, bro, I got you the PS5. And they, like, hug or something, you know? I just remember thinking, like, just keep it, man. Like, what are you doing? They make money off the video. I mean, if you got, like, a few grand for destroying a console, would you do it? Probably yes, right? Yes, absolutely. Right, yeah. Like 10 grand, 100 grand, grand, or whatever. I, I don't uh, know how much uh, videos make. You know what I mean. 
But making no money in watching it, it's like, boo. Yeah, that's, that's <laughs> funny. Right. Scalper simulator. Uh, I don't know, you're gonna play. Yeah, we talked about Back from Blood. See, do we miss anything else? Either. Get hairdresser simulator, or you have to explain to a customer, no, I can't do it, you have lice. No. <laughs> that's fine. Like, I'm actually surprised they don't have like a hairdresser. I guess hair is pretty hard to render in a game. But they could do it for yeah. it's like spaghetti. <laughs> you know there's actually a game where you play as spaghetti? It's called Freddy's Spaghetti. Freddy's Spaghetti? Yeah. It's like yeah. an indie game. Oh, yeah. And it's that's actually kind of good. Hmm. I think. I gotta go back and look at my room. But I remember being like, oh, this is surprisingly decent. I think they just released a sequel for it. Like, hmm. The only annoying thing is it's like Series X optimized, so it requires the next gen storage. And I'm like, this game should does not need next gen storage. I think they do it just to like sell it as a selling point. Oh, it's optimized. But yeah, you literally play as a big, big, a big story to it and all that. It's not. I just like imagine you call Paul and your partners like meatballs or something like that. Like, no, there were meatballs in it. Idiot. Uh, really big breakout, and you attack people, and then you go into the future, and then you go, and then you try to get back to the time to meet your master. Very complicated. Of I think I got all the achievements off of it, which is why I was mainly. Playing. I got a kick when you're telling me about that shark, like man eater game or something. That's your edge story. Uh, yeah, but the story in that one, you know, it's, I'm not joking. They actually put like a whole the revenge tale, like Jaw the Revenge, if that was good. <laughs> Thanks, Yoda. Or choked out my Ewok, you should feel ashamed. <laughs> he liked it. <laughs> I'm talking about the Ewok. Yeah, Yoda's kind of like overpowered. I don't even think my Yoda's that leveled up, and he's just kicking ass. So hard to shoot, right? <laughs> That's exactly it, but he's, he's got like a great lock on him. Very powerful with the saber. God oh, damn, you kids have. Does this presence like heal people? Is that what this thing? Bots. The pleasure. Bots. Die. I think I got the achievement reach rank 50. It just popped up on my computer, so I got it. Nice! Yeah, it just saw it on the computer there. Pretty spaghetti and 4K under 20 FPS read. That's fun. Like, did, you actually, did you actually look it up and stuff? Because it was like legit. Like, immediately. Yeah. Freddy Spaghetti. Either. It's kind of funny. Um, this is like one of the longest times I've been there. Like, it's really just like. Really invincible. Oh, Yoda's gonna die. Yoda's gonna die. Anybody have any health? You need one of those characters that does health? You don't need to heal up, bro. Haha, <laughs> these their own teammate shield again. It's funny. <laughs> I love holding off like four or five of them with an Ewok. <laughs> with an Ewok? Uh, it's funny, rank 15 never touching the game again. Either my god or playing with scrubs because Yoda's, <laughs> Yoda's just, Yeah, Yoda's kicking ass there. 
Let's see, there's the achievement. Let's let's pop it up here. The fool, so strong with this one. I miss getting notifications on my TV. You know, you get to see that kind of stuff. So I'm missing like six achievements in the for 25 objectives in Starfighter assaults. How many kill streaks with scepter ships? All all the ship achievements. You know? Yeah, I probably played Starfighter Assault the least, man, myself. Yeah, this is like all the achievements I'm based on. Ain't ever gonna happen. I was just a really good Yoda, man. I was. This is my Yoda skill. This is the way. <laughs> this picture, like, Yoda, give a damn! I do not. <laughs> God, I am. God, I am, yeah. I'm, or pizza it is. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Am I playing on TV or monitor? I play on the TV. Samsung QC. Which I have a review of it up on the channel. So many people ask me if I bet. Like, I play on this one. never anymore. It was one of the smartest things I've ever done video wise. Like, reference it all the time. Never mind, I'm gonna nail LG. Like, you guys get the hell. August, on a TV review. Weird. Maybe they just don't value my partnership anymore. Ooh. Well, I mean, it's new PR people there. They just don't know you, though. <laughs> Probably. But it you know, that's why you go to CS every year. Yeah. I always get so sad when, like, the PR team shift and stuff, because I keep up with all that stuff. I guess that could be negative or positive, depending on if the new PR guys like you more or not, you know? I found usually when PR people move, I actually get advantage somewhere else and they move up higher on the chain. Oh, really? Yeah. Kind of nice. Mm hmm. They usually take you with you, or take you with them, like working with them. I was actually pretty sad. Uh, the one guy I worked with at Xbox since I, like, started. Really Oh, 2013 or something like that. He recently moved to a new company. <laughs> you know, like, <laughs> eight, eight years I've been working with him. I was just like, this is going to be different. No, I, I love working with the new folks that are there. Like, I mean, I've been working with the folks at Xbox that, like, you know, replacing stuff for, like, a couple years. But I was just, yeah. oh my god, this is a culture shock. <laughs> you know. I mean, you, you get used to, like, emailing them about things. You have an issue, you just... Yeah. Oh. Ow. Wild. I mean, good for him, too, but... I bet he'd appreciate to know he was missed. No. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, gosh, sometimes I don't even get told. Uh, so I worked with this lady that did the Universal review uh, all by herself. Ran it for, like, decades or something. And uh, uh, I worked with her for, like, five years, and then... I haven't gotten a universal review in there for a while, and I emailed it. And I was like, "What's going on here?" I guess you retired, and it's just like nobody told me. Oh, I see that. <laughs> and I was like, "Well, you know, I'd, I'd wish best wishes with your retirement and all that." Vanishes. <laughs> At retail price? No, I, I got it to review. So I, this. So. Am I a Marvel fan? Yeah, I quite enjoy Marvel, except I haven't watched really the shows, which is odd. I did WandaVision. I did the shows, which is odd. The big Marvel fan. I am excited about What If, but I don't know. I asked them to rip like, the first two episodes. And... What If looked pretty neat. I've enjoyed the show so far. That's good. Yeah. I'm just like... I gotta, I gotta write a, a write up for uh, Modoc. I watched that through the portal because they didn't ask me to. It was just in the portal, so I'm like, I'll, I'll watch this. Like, oh, this is actually pretty funny. 
really messed up, but you know, it's, it's, is it's it? That's, I looked at it and I was like, what is this? You know, like Modoc, man. Yeah, I wasn't sure if it was like a child's cartoon or not. It's pretty you adult. Know? It's, it's, and it's pretty adult. It's really adult. <laughs> Now what do I do? I got level 50 here. Are you level 52? I think you are, right? Yes. Yeah. Wait, what do you do in this game? Now? Uh, play for giggles. Hmm. Alright. <laughs> <Still sounds silly. laughs> no. <laughs> Not when you're trying to be the best! No, I don't know. Something about our universe is a dead state. Playing on a projector? That's funny. I could be an Ewok. Uh, actually, my pal Mitchell there, he played on a projector quite a bit. Get a 4K projector. Oh wow! Uh, they've actually got some pretty good projector tech at CES. In the projectors in a while, they're actually like that's neat. I remember being a kid and one of my dad's friends like he'd set up the projector when he played, but I haven't seen someone do it since then. Yeah, no, they're they're coming back. They've got uh, really impressive tech with them. They're very good. You don't need to have them in dark rooms anymore, even. Yeah, pretty cool. Emulating on Raspberry Pi, jeez. Oh, you guys. <laughs> Sometimes folks are just funny. You friendly on the ground. Dur -dur -dur -dur. <laughs> Love running around as the Ewok. He makes little noises, man. Gaming and a smile. <laughs> gaming and a smile. This is what next gen gaming's all about. Oh, we oh, I got smoked in the face. I eat walked so in the end it doesn't even. Oh. <laughs> 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 uh. oh. Thoughts with. Block thing and show me. You know, that's good. The Imperials are moments away from defeat. Keep at it. That guy should just be stabbing people. Fuck. So the bots, you know, regular people would notice you, but the bots are always on your ass in the. Yeah, pretty good actually. Sometimes. <laughs> You're annoying. Get that either. Jedi and you start rolling. Wish they were in it, us. I mean, really don't need to. I'm gonna finish watching last season of Sherlock Holmes. I'll enjoy. Imagine that was fun. Netflix is Sherlock Holmes? Isn't that like BBC Sherlock Holmes? Will I be doing more flight sim streams? Uh, I'm not sure. I might. I'm not sure. Like, it probably eventually got really fun, but uh, I think it's mostly videos now. The streams for Flight Sim initially were just to kind of like show it off and get people to it, if that makes sense. Um, and then I'm hoping that the you know because of the streams, the tours start taking off so I can first. Like, yeah. And are you, are you not enjoying the, the touring? And it's kind of fun. Seems like the feedback's been pretty good on them so far. You know, doing the streams. Just like, uh, well, a, lot of, a lot of stuff to do right now. I need to do a stream for like the Ascent, and Ariana Grande concert. And, uh... Right. <laughs> <laughs> That's a busy guy, you know. <laughs> but, uh, but I do need to do the Ascent. I think it was. Oh, yeah, I think I'm doing a Gears 5 stream this week. As the new season drop, the last operation for Gears 5 before they stop supporting it. Uh, it's on my calendar. Are you gonna do another Gears game? Yeah, yeah, they're working on a new one. Cool. But it's the last uh, Gears 5 uh, like update, like the last like seasonal update that they're doing. Okay. Yeah, so I was like, you no, know, it's it's good, just a good time to tie it into the game, just to do and around then. Yeah. And there was some other stuff. Oh yeah, this weekend back for blood. 
I mean, it's definitely not no. I, I do like streaming fights. It's a lot of fun. But it's also like when it fits in. Yeah. Probably starting to get some new stuff to do, right? Oh yeah, the games are not stopping now until uh, uh, until January probably. It's gonna slow down a bit again. I'm actually very curious to see how the streaming thing is gonna fit into my regular schedule. Do you think it's slowing you down at all, or? I definitely have a lot less time to like specifically, record, but at the same time, now I can stream and like. You know, Play something at the same time that I have to play by myself without doing it. Like, you get yeah. what I mean? I just don't necessarily, like, I just don't know how it's gonna affect my time scheduling. Because I've never, like, had a. You know. Uh, I've never done the streaming this long, so I don't know how that will impact the holiday stuff. I think it'll be a benefit, though. Doing stuff around the holidays and streaming, like, I think it'll boost. But I'm just kind of That's wondering. Really cool. Timeline wise, how everything's fit in. Yeah. Like, it's gonna be nuts. Like I said, I've got like. I got a message with. Get all other schools written. Uh, because I need to sign up for the film festival, and I need to sign up for the. Calgary Expo. Looking forward to the Calgary Expo. That should be fun. Yeah. And actually, we're probably going to be a little harder to cover it video-wise, because usually I do like a little video where I have the cosplayers kill me. Oh yeah, that's funny. <laughs> Very funny. Uh, my favorite is Jason comes from behind and stabs me. Yeah. <laughs> I'm laughing. It's so fun. Uh, yeah. I do love the costumes there. People put so much good work into their stuff. Mm-hmm. Definitely. I'm like, I remember the one. <laughs> what? Oh, I was just—I remember the one guy was uh, in the Republic Commando costume, and it was so cool. And I saw another one like dressed up like a Hydra list from StarCraft. And I thought it was so funny because he had like a slithering tail going down his back for a little bit. And I don't know, it was funny. Hmm. My favorite yeah. was Doom Slayer, and the girlfriend was the Cockademon. Perfect. I remember you showed me that one, yeah. Yeah, that was that was my favorite so far, but you know, with COVID and stuff being kind of you know well done here, but not quite done. I, I just wonder how that's going to impact like stuff like that, and it being September, you know, the weather and stuff. I just yeah, and less people. I have no idea. PS Five or Series X? I mean, I got both. I enjoy them both. I play more Series X, obviously. Uh, saw Jungle Cruise, and I feel you were a bit harsh on my review. I gave it, like, what, a 6.2 out of 10? That's pretty good. It's a very generic, okay action movie with some decent twists. Yeah. I mean, keep in mind, you know, games are kind of hyperinflated for scores, whereas movies, you're, you're able to score it more, like, naturally. But, like, a 6 is a pretty good for a film. That's, that's fine. It's a good adventure. It's nothing amazing, but, you know, it's decent. Good night, sexy... Captain Sexy, thanks. It was like pretty generic. And the chemistry, like, there were so many. Pretty fine. Like, the rock just be. I'm max level now, so I just, like. So I just don't get any. Nice. Anymore. Like, what do I. What do I. Nope. Do? Life is pointless. You are a champion. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even. What do I even do now with, like. We just don't install this game. <laughs> You can do the infinite leveling of your heroes now. Why I'm just like... <laughs> what is life? What is love? I don't... What's my purpose now? You have to just become people that played the starship game and go pew 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 pew. Yeah. Are people gonna join? Do we need to get like a new lobby or? I would guess a new lobby. All right. What do we? What? What is life? Oh, well, it's one twenty-seven. Oof. Should Ooh. we switch over to uh... Heroes of the Villains? I'll close it off with that. I'm gonna play a bit of it for a while. One thirty. Sure. But how much sleep? I'm gonna be too tired for your movie, right? 
Yeah, we gotta get about more a half hour more. Okay. Let's do uh ship battles. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Maybe you could boost those ones. Do people even play the ship battles anymore? It's funny. I don't even know if you could find this. Okay, this wasn't too big on him. Do we do heroes versus villains or hero showed it? Villains, right? Heroes versus villains, yeah. Liking and subscribing since it's a new match. You're damn right, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> Hi there. Not seeing the numbers go up. Why are you? Good question. What is what is life now? Face the same guy. What everybody. is love? No. I mean, that's his brand, The Rock. That's how he makes his bills. I mean, there was a fun twist in this one. It's like The Rock playing. And he had more chemistry with the guy than he did with but there was just like no romantic <laughs> chemistry there. Like that's it was so one of the more cool. more like forced romances I've ever seen. You know, it's like they do not, they do not connect at all. I like the cat though. The cat was funny. Terrible CGI, but then the cat was just like cat like drinks in one scene and just like vomits. And... That's that cute. <gasps> My precious boss has been taken. I know we're talking about it the whole time, but I could just see watching a movie with a rock in it, and he loses a fight, and that would make the movie for me. Yeah. You know, it'd be like, no way! Like, <laughs> Look contractually. <laughs> right. <laughs> Funny. Can I get some mall cards? My mall doesn't have any cards upgraded. Crap. I think I... Yeah, just the way it is. So obviously we're like throwing down here. I don't have Bosk, so what is life? Look at him with his beautiful tongue out. <sighs> Yoda looks kind of Just a little. Looks like he's gonna DJ. Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Anyways, it's a new match, so be sure to use the force to press that like button so more people can check it out. Ooh. Much of stuff, great donations, cool subscribing is awesome. Wow. I was not expecting the fun stuff into that. I feel like people are too sweaty at this point. Almost, I'm already dead. Oh, yeah. That's where I see you die from like a Luke Skywalker or Vader and it's like level 600 something. <laughs> I'm a level 8 mall. How do I increase this, this card's skill point? Oh, the upgraded from the collections menu? Well, that doesn't help me. Think about John Cena. Definitely typecast. Yeah, the Black Adam casting I think is really neat, but at the same time, you know he's gonna be like an anti-hero thing in it. It's gonna be like not the bad guy. He's gonna be very... No, good guy in it. Okay, Maul's not working. Maybe we should try... Captain Phasma! Without Bosk, I feel like I'm just worthless. Level 3 Captain Fastball. Uh, do we have any guys with guns? I Maybe I should be Iden Verso. She's leveled up a bit for me. Might be worthwhile. Could work. Hey Matt, thanks for the donation. I really do appreciate that. Although on my screen it's showing just oh there we go, it's the one up hippo eating. I would really love it if YouTube would allow me to make custom gifts for stuff. But well, you know what frustrates me? YouTube removed so I do the YouTube stories, right? I like to put the little stories down. Yeah. And they removed the option to the mute clips. Hmm. I don't know why I actually tweeted at them and asked about that because I was like, "What the hell, guys?" So now I have to edit the video, remove the quit the the audio, then add the like. It's just like an inconvenient step. Let me see. Where was the? Well, we can't share specifics about the mute button. We recommend letting our system. It's like, well, you can't use the feedback system. On the wow. <laughs> just frustrating. It's like this is such an unnecessary step that I have to do. Because, you know, sometimes it's not like I'm not using like anything copy. It's probably because people use it for copyright and they get the, you know, the audio and they deal with the copyright stuff. But like, 
when I'm out somewhere in nature and you know, there's people yelling in the background, I don't want that. that Jedi is you know, crap playing through and stuff. Yeah. Slay them with sweetness, you know how it is. Bonjour, man. Do, do a bonjour, Matt. Uh... Me? Uh, bonjour, Matt. Bonjour. I expect you to know three lines of French. Oh, <laughs> I got you, dude. I got you. <laughs> I keep trying to learn it, but I keep forgetting what the phrases are, and it's just like... Yeah. French would be a cool language to learn. Yeah, it would be. Well, I mean, it is our secondary language, right? Right. Well, Jungle Cruise is was... meant to be a serious movie, but I ra I rated it like one. Well, I mean, you know, you gotta rate a movie based on like how good it is, the quality of it, and stuff. You know, I, I get that it's a fun movie, but that doesn't make it a good movie. Like it was fine. I, I, it was definitely wrong, though. Not that movie was. Like, so it was really Did he fulfill the goal of going on a cruise in the jungle? Yeah. <laughs> but I mean, it's like, it's because it's a fun movie, it doesn't special or... Yeah. I don't know, like, people were, like, you know, I did the King Kong vs. Godzilla review, and I gave it, like, what, a 5 or a 6, and people were like, no, it's a 10 out of 10, and I'm like, that movie is not a 10 out of 10. <laughs> this is why fan reviews for something should just not peel out, because it's just like, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the movie, if you think that's 10 out of 10, like... <laughs> You know, it's just like, you really are not appreciating the art form if you're thinking that's 10 out of 10. <laughs> that's the same person that probably looks at something like a, you know, highly acclaimed movie and they're like, it's stupid, I don't get it. Oh my god. <laughs> like, it, it was fun, kind of. Just what? Like, yeah. that was definitely not like a 9 out of 10. Well, like, when you were just talking about it, that like a 6.5 out of 10 isn't bad, and it's kind of funny that... You know, if you're thinking about that rating system, it really isn't. Like, if you're saying a movie's 10 out of 10, you're, like, suggesting this is one of the best films you've ever seen. Mm -hmm. You know, it could go in a favorite list. You know, like, even a 9 out of 10 doesn't mean it was perfect, but, like, it is. You know, this was an absolute amazing movie. It's like a masterpiece, like, basically. Right. Going by that standard, you know, like, a 7 or 6 is saying it was good. It's just, it's not like it was the best ever, but it, it was good. Like Christ, so, yeah. so for, I use like Metacritic as my like thing for what, what's a good movie. Like beforehand, I'll be like, yeah. okay, let's see what it looks like. I'm getting stomped here. I don't know. Are you getting like? Oh yeah, no, I'm getting wasted. <laughs> like I just like I killed one person. We were just getting annihilated. Should we find a new lobby or something? Like this is sure. This is just, uh... like getting snapped. We're down a person too. Anyways, but like. You know, on Metacritic, when a movie's got, like, a 5 out of 10, I'm like, okay, it'll be a good movie. Because critics for, like, like movies are a lot... It's a lot different of a scoring system. Gaming is really inflated because company stuff are so, like, expectant of higher reviews. Like, a 6 out of 10, is, it's, it's a fine movie. There's there's nothing wrong with it. I mean, there are issues with it, why it isn't rated higher. But you know what I mean? It's, like, it's not like it's terrible or anything, right? Like Yeah. Well, yeah, that's it, right? Like, if a 10 or a 9 out of 10 is, like, the greatest movies ever, and an 8 is, like, yeah, it was, had a little... Fl is really good, yeah, 7's not even that too bad. Like, yeah, I just... Yeah, I can see where a 6 or a 7, it's it's not bad. It really isn't. No. You know? If you're saying, like, 3 or 4, you know, barely pushing 4, I could see where, yeah, that's iffy. Like, you probably, in your opinion, someone wouldn't really enjoy it, you know? Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. You get it. Dreams taste like cotton candy life is short. Make it sweet. Good night. <laughs> the games do I have for you at the end. all time most hours in? Uh, Halo MCC Gears 4. This one I've probably got a lot of hours in. Those are my two big I can think of off the top of my head. Busk! Let's see. I thought the guy and the rock were going to have a romantic relationship. That's what I was talking about. That's why they had better they chemistry. Had that much chemistry. That's awesome. Well, the guy was like Disney gay, right? So you could see each yeah. scene where if this released in like a China or something, they'd cut that scene out. <laughs> but you know what I mean? Like, I have yeah. seven days and five hours in this. <laughs> but, uh, you, wondering. you know, it was like him and The Rock had some really good moments. And I was like, they kind of have like amazing chemistry. You know what I mean? I was just kind of like, 
<laughs> Dare I say? I don't know why. I, I think The Rock wouldn't do that in the movie. No, he I wouldn't feel do that. Like he... But why not? Rock, come on, be an actor. No. Seriously, yeah. <laughs> I, think... I mean, he shouldn't have any issues with it, but I, I doubt his contract right? would. See, he wants to yeah, show just... up as like a manly, manly guy. I mean, I don't have any issue with it to any degree. I'm just saying, like, they had clearly had more chemistry, and as you know, as Kevin said, they're right. chat. He's like, you know, he thought they were an ever romantic thing, and then it, you know, right. it's him and Emily Blunt, and I'm just like, they just had no, like, there was nothing there where I was like, oh, it's great that these two ended up. I was kind of like, why did these two end up? That doesn't make any sense. Like, it's just it feels weird, and that's funny. I just, like, I don't know, that's kind of what I think, though, like, with The Rock, is I know he's got his image, but, like, how, I always feel like that would make the movie better in my mind if it turned out, like, I don't know, he was the weak guy, or, you know, he had the romantic interest with a dude, it would be so, like, oh, I wasn't expecting that out of The Rock, like, good for you, you know? Like, yeah, no, I, I like, that's, why range. do you think, uh, yeah. that when you look at comedians, they usually play the best dramatic actor, because it's out of their... You know, their box and stuff. That's usually why they give the best roles and dramatic roles. Some that. comedians do great in dramatic roles, though. So. Mm -hmm. that's, that's what I'm saying. Is you put them out of their element, sometimes you get a really good thing. Yeah. Just, and I don't think that's his thing. Because, like, like The Rock said, is like when you you watch my movie, like the Family Fun, Thriller Ride, where everything is good, that's his brand. Yeah. Oh. Kiss him, Rock. Kiss him on the lips. Well, so I was sitting there, I was just like, wow, these two are really like. Like vibing, I was like, I'm getting some vibes out of this. Pretty cool, I like. I actually thought yeah, it was we'll start shipping them halfway through the movie. I, I was, I was like, you know, they sat there on the rock. He's like, you know, I'm, I like different types of people. The rock's like, he's like whittling some wood. It's cool, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. And I was like. I'm like, oh, okay. This is like, it was like spicy almost. I was like, okay. <laughs> I mean, I was fine with it. I don't have any issues. Yeah. Like, but I actually thought that was like that would have been a good direction, but I I knew it wasn't. But <laughs> it's just like, it's like, like a broke back mountain type thing where it's just like he's just right. whittling wood. The other guy's just sitting there talking about the struggles, and he's like, that's cool, <laughs> man. <laughs> but you know, if you watch that movie and like. China or any of the Middle Eastern places, that's obviously just not happened that scene. Yeah. But just funny. It's, uh, it caters to us, but then they can cut it easily and make it, you know, not happen in other places. It's actually quite genius. Different values, different places, all that. Yeah. You can use Eddie, that's funny. What about our vibes? <laughs> I've been too hard there, Kev. Too hard. Five <laughs> 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 all the time. Yeah. And yes, Bolger to the highest degree, man. Highest degree. Oh, it looks like the the hype for the Battlefront stream has just died down because of our sexy rock chat. Oh really? Yeah. I think it would have hyped up. <laughs> it was getting too hot. In. That's funny. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so fun. That was just. Uh, I mean, I actually think that the guy character had some pretty good moments in the film, and if they didn't base the whole thing about his like type of person he was, he actually would have been a really fun side comedian. I see he was still pretty good in it. Although they came up with yeah. a particular moment at the end just to try to like sideline him. Like, you know when they all of a sudden in a movie they're just like, okay, this character doesn't need to be here for this part of the film, and they just like come up with a convenient two second thing where it's like, they can't be they're here. Gone. And, yeah. right. <laughs> then obviously I don't want to spoil them to be able to watch it, but kind of funny. Enjoy the puns. Oh, I hated the puns in that. They pun are they cheesy? Hard. They are like cheesy hard puns I think like in the film they were showing everybody reacting all uncomfortably to the puns I was just like oh That's funny. god the puns I know some people play them, but That's funny. I was just like this is this is too hardcore Can we go inside this There's place? some movies like that man like, I remember Force Awakens just to bring it up that first scene when like Kylo Ren's looking all menacing and they got uh, Poe down and then he's like are, are you gonna talk or am I gonna talk? And I just like I was like, what? That's more like yeah, I don't know. It, 
it, it, I don't know. Yeah, it, it didn't. Those, hit those with are me. quips. Those are Marvel quips. That's like a signature are Marvel they? thing. Okay. Uh, so a quip is, is a it? funny little thing. A pun is kind of like. Right, but it's like dad joke, basically. I guess. Okay. You know, that's I was thinking like, what the, the humor doesn't land. I'm not like a huge pun know. person. I was like, oh my. And I, I know a lot of people that love puns, so it's like, this is just gonna. People are gonna love this part. I'm, oh, this. For me, I'm just. Going to my mines, Anakin. Ha ha ha. Anakin's a one shot if you can get him. I mean, I got a gun, I should be able to shoot him, but they're kind of nerf the hell out of boss's gun here. You run into it. For the chosen one, he's sure a bit of a. bit of a bitch. <laughs> uh oh, it's Ray Skywalker running around over there. Ray Skywalker, guys. That's funny. My vibes, sorry, I'd start vibrate. God damn it. Kev, or Kev sorry. Gotta do the distinction. <laughs> 38 level boss! I should actually be probably playing some of my secondary heroes to level them up a bit. Triple XP on. Luke's like a one hit. He's got 54 health. Get him. I wanna get him. Alright. Would you like to bite on my stick? God damn it. Uh, why did you watch that at home or in the theaters, Kev? <laughs> I, I, I am curious. Like, I think that would have been better in the theaters. I honestly wonder when they do the home screenings, it's CGI just like. Like the bitrate that they send those out at for those screens. So goddamn low. You know, like the artifacting on the like the the blacks on the screen it's just like it's great like it's got these like weird marks on it it's like when people were watching uh game of thrones in one episode and the bitrate for that dark knight fight episode was so bad and you just like you yeah didn't see any of the bitrate it's just the levels like, like oh god because they were for it so much it's like come on i guys. remember hearing them talk about that and they're like oh, well it was a battle at night you're not supposed to see and it was like no one sends a cavalry charge in the middle of the night when they can't see though <laughs> yeah that was stupid that whole battle was stupid seriously yeah oh. yeah the, the bit rate they send out for this movie just like jesus guys I hurt them with my minds, but somebody's gotta protect Bosk. Bosk's not a frontline fighter. Get him into my minds, guys. I defeated somebody. I defeated Ray Skywalker. I defeated Obi-Wan too with my mines. Nobody expects the mines of Bosk. Told you I was a Bosk. Uh, uh, uh. That's a pun. <laughs> I like how we're actually doing alright in this one. This is a Bosk. Kick ass. Three player kill streak. Carry. Look at this little droid's gonna go into all the mines. Almost dead. <laughs> Finish off the droid, man. <laughs> I'm dead now. You gotta support your Bosk. To support your Bosk, you get the kills. Where it's at. Bosking it up. <laughs> Every dollar is a mine and you're best boss. <laughs> God damn it. Funny. Get some mines out here. Oh crap. Oh crap. Roll into the mines. Roll into the mines. I'm... I heard somebody a lot. 182 player damage. That must have been a good chunk of some soul. If we rope them in and we get them into the mines, you can finish them off pretty easily. You believe in the boss. Ooh. Bosk way or the Hosk way? That is it. <laughs> oh, come on. He just launched me in the air, Luke. I don't know where he was like, Phew. He saw it in theaters. I don't know. Ice Immersive 2D. Ice Immersive 2D. Is that like our D box kind of thing?
You know, I thought it was funny. They were supposed to just put in special seats and everything into the Chinook Theater for movies, but they only did like one theater there. They only. I was like, this sucks. I was third place. Bosk level in. You're just bosking around that match, man. <laughs> I am the boss. The Bosk side is strong with it. If you're a key man, do your combo, but good. I could say okay. That makes sense. Beef jerky's good with anything. <laughs> Who should I play? I usually play as Ray, but I can get a mannequin and try just to level him up a bit. You know what I mean? Level points. Might be good. Yeah, Anakin's fun. Flex B. Oof. It's just a shame. He's nowhere near as powerful as he was when he first came out. Mm hmm. I think a lot of people got nerfed. Oh. Oh, yeah. Nerfed, everyone else was. More powerful, I am now. <laughs> Let's not nerf BB-8. No. <laughs> you underestimate my power. No. <laughs> oh, is this like a time paradox? We're fighting him. Ooh, it's like some sort of meta thing. <laughs> Seriously. Let's just get him Obi Wan. Like throw you outside the map. I, I got sliced apart in two hits. <laughs> this is the worst lightning that killed me. This is just crazy. Witness the power of the dark side. The power of the dark side. I don't have like any cards for this character. Oh, Palpatine's max level. Ooh. His lightning is just like great. I almost. I have one health left for Ball? Get out of here. <laughs> Get out of here with that. One health. One health. Unbelievable. Yeah, I kind of feel like Palpatine when he's like maxed out is a little too powerful. Can't even get near the guy. Yeah, I got mauled this time. I've almost got Kylo here. If somebody's got a gun, you can one shot. Oh, and then Ma's buddy uh, Palpa Palpatine comes over here. Yeah, <laughs> I can't believe he's like successfully oh, evading me. Oh, I did that thingy where I've got retribution. There's like two guys nice. in there. Nice. Crazy action. That retribution power is really cool on like supremacy. If you get yeah. it? Kills a lot of people. You got like a field. Palpatine and Yoda are the most annoying. Oh god, Yoda just like kicks the ass. So does Palpatine. If he's leveled up. If he's leveled up, Palpatine. He's too dangerous to be kept alive. The Windu is not off. <laughs> yep. I'm screwed. See, I just, I really don't love the lightsaber in this game. Lightsaber play. I feel like Jedi Academy. Such a different quality. 
it's an academy is probably the best lightsaber play ever, though, man. Like, yeah, it still holds up. Love too. that it's game. Damn impressive. Do a video on that best lightsaber. Did I get off? That's how games lost to history, if most people remember it. Still backwards of battle. They just a re release for it on PS4 uh, and 5. I think my video for it did very well. Put that up. That's cool. Yeah, no, it's a lot of people know about that one. Uh, my Series X video, only about 5,000. But my PS4 review for Jedi Knight Jedi Academy did. 45,000. That was a pretty good money make. I sold myself. Okay, I just got smoked by three of them. We need to, like, group up and harness the power of the dark side. <laughs> it's not the Jedi way. Right. Well, I mean, we're losing, so, you know, Jedi right. way. <laughs> out the window on this one. Jedi Way got everybody killed. Sometimes you gotta fight dirty. I mean, if you think about it, like, bringing balance to the Force, was it really worth it? Like, there's literally, like, you know, thousands of Jedi died. I know the Jedi in the right. end, like, won out, but, like, damn. Definitely not worth all the Jedi lives lost. I like the idea that balance to the Force is actually a negative thing, and I don't know why they would want it. That, like, I the mean, Jedi were in charge. Negative. Well, Jedi the Jedi positive. were in charge, right? Yeah. It was the good guys. So how do you balance it out? Well, you let the evil guys take over. You know, yeah. just, and then you take them. Mm-hmm. Like, I get that part, but I just mean, like, yeah. being balanced with the Force, literally, like, long-term, definitely <laughs> not worth all the deaths and stuff. No, not at all. Like... I got killed again. So what's next after episode 9? They're doing a bunch of little standalone movies. I'm a little disappointed people complain so much. Uh, Ryan Johnson that was... Did the Last Jedi, he was given his own trilogy at one point. Very excited about that. Because it would have been really cool to have a precise trilogy that actually made sense. Right. What would it have been based off of though? We have no idea. We'll never know, yeah. I guess. Probably would have been the old Republic, I would imagine. That would be cool. Got a wine. Oh look, one of the Skywalkers is here. High Republic books. Of... Oh yeah, High Re... I thought it was weird. They like they talked about High Republic like it was only going to be the books, but now it sounds like they're doing still not. Like, it, it kind of sounds odd to be doing a time in Star Wars where there's, like, you know, the Jedi are just, like, unbeatable and there's not really going up against. I've heard the books are actually pretty good, but it's just, you know, there's always, you always got to do a period where there's a lot of conflict. That's the fun of the Star Wars, of no Jedi or Jedi, like, falling and stuff. is kind of... Hello there. That'd be neat to get a perspective of like just the Jedi keeping peace or something. You know, well, that's the high little role. battle here and there. Yeah, they, they have all those books and stuff. I think they're doing some shows for it too. But you can go read the books, and it's about the High Republic. It's the golden age of the Jedi, I guess. Completely detached. They have ice immersive theaters. The Ryan cut. That cut was his cut, though. Apparently they didn't, the studios didn't infer at all in that movie. Perfectly. It's beautiful. Uh, we don't have ice immersive, we have like D-box seats which like move and stuff, but we don't have any like gimmicky things like ice or wind or all that. You're talking about like a 4DX chair, right? I don't know, I don't think we have anything like that. Boba Fett ends the round.
and prepare to build for services rendered. We lost. Well, we tried. <laughs> I think we'll have one final match. Ooh. For all the marbles of the galaxy. Hopefully we get villains, so it's a good one. <laughs> yeah. Funny. Oh, I just saw a video pop up when I was searching this. Like, years ago, there was a mod for Jedi Academy where they made, like, a fighting game. You know, like Mortal Kombat or something. Me. Did a video. A lot of fun. Yeah, it was. I think it was like Vader versus what stuff, and you just side. You know, it's like a side perspective, like a fighting game. Very well done. Very very cool. Were you saying they like did a mod too, where you could do like the series, the movies, uh, the prequels, and that? Yeah. It's called Star Wars Battles or something like that. Very cool. I'm gonna have to. I think I'll maybe go back and do some video of those. That would be fun. That would be a very fun tour. That would be neat to see. I have to turn off all the audio this time. I remember there being like a lot of copyrighted <laughs> Star Wars music. I think they borrow also the audio from. Passionate strikes. The passion of the Skywalker. Right, he really cares when he swings his lightsaber. Passionately. Where's Bosk? Bosk is love. Bosk is love. Live, laugh, Bosk. Get Live, that laugh, tattooed. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, guys, I think this might be our final battle. We'll see how things go. It's always a good time to, you know, like the stream, question stuff, great, donation, full subscribe. Awesome. I guess at least tomorrow, you know, when we go to stream again, I'll be able to talk about the uh, Suicide Squad. No, I hear about that. Oh. I think tomorrow I'm doing Cool. Unless oh. something randomly pops up. Because I think the. Because if I get the codes Thursday, Friday, that I can actually update. And I'll ship one your way, Kevin. Ooh wee. No. I do love Ray with that yellow lightsaber. I think I say that every time. <laughs> yeah, it's it's grown on me. It's definitely grown on me. I feel like it's watching a movie at home with those LEDs that sync to you. That's interesting. I know I like the D box chair. I don't know if you've sat in them. Really shakes and moves, and it doesn't feel silly, it feels like the immersive. I don't think I ever have. Uh, if you're watching like a big action movie, I suggest it, but other movies don't, and use your scene points for it because it's very the D box. Yeah, but like for big movies like Star Wars, like Endgame, we, we always go for the D box. Uh, oh, what's really cool, I, I get to see the Suicide Squad's gonna be an IMAX. Watch it, but it's the crappy Chinook IMAX. But it's still IMAX, I guess. I wanna do, they have, uh, Silver City, uh, the, that one has a 70 mil on it. I got this dunker, like, what? Did they play the same movie? Was it Disney? That would be a good movie for that. Yeah, because when it's on film, it's, it's a lot different. Right? Yeah. Go back to your homework. I wonder, that'd be weird to like wake up right away and then get ready for a movie. I do kind of see an issue with the time of it. Eh. I just hope the, uh, the stealth is going to be there. No. <laughs> That'll be funny. For the Republic, Star Wars guys here pretty late. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers to the last battle from the street. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it's been so much fun. Can't believe this is how it has to end. You can always do retro battlefront. Retro battlefront. That would be fun. Oh.
This is actually kind of bad to think about. End quick. of a dynasty. I love the guys who kill you and then emo. <laughs> like, I'd almost rather get teabagged. Like, <laughs> okay, I have any emotes. You'd rather get. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, I guess some of the Halo Infinite bots, they do the crowd shots, so actually sometimes you get teabagged by the bots in Halo. I heard it. I thought that was a meme. That's hilarious, man. Yeah. The yeah they play dirty. Learning. Yeah. <laughs> Crowd shot. That's It's got like a shield bubble. <laughs> Get out of here. Cut down, Boba Fett like you. Nothing. He witnessed the true power of the Ray Palpa Palpa Palpatine side. <laughs> Your favorite Skywalker, any answer other than Ray is wrong. Yep. <laughs> I don't even want to hear your opinions. Educate yourself. Really? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm playing as Ray, so that doesn't matter anyway. She's invisible. Have I tried Gears 5 Operation 8? That's that's what I'm talking about, where that's going to be like... Uh, I think tomorrow's stream will be Gears 5 because of Operation... And I think the last Operation up... I'm kind of planning it for that one. Jump that poor Kylo Ren. <laughs> hey, get that dark BB-8 here. Getting away. Doing like a cloud of smoke, it's really weird. Did he just escape from me in the smoke? Dark BP-8, it's crazy. Crazy. Going down, I Time for Shike, gotta get those dubs. You know how it is. Enjoy your, your slumber thing. What about the Angry Bird Star Wars? Let's do some really bizarre stream. Okay. Gotta get more subscribers, and then I can do some really silly stuff. <laughs> The same the one game I do a streamer. I get a bunch of people competing in like air hockey or like the hockey with like the platform. You know what I mean? Where they got the skills. yeah. Not that air big. hockey turn of it would be hilarious, man. Get a couple drinks going or something, you know? Yep. Some uh... air hockey tournament. High octane action. Enough will ever get to that level though. But it would be damn. I just cut the dark BB eight in the ass and it rolled away. <laughs> I got shot. Did you do your flight survey for Halo Infinite? Actually, no, I did not. I don't even know where you do that. Honestly. I was kind of looking for it and I couldn't figure it out. I think I have to go to the Halo Waypoint site. I, I was actually looking at it. I think because how I got invited to is different. I don't know if I have any email or something about it. I, just, but I do want to give my thoughts on it. Yeah. He did it. Wow, he did really good. Oh. This is it. Or should we do one more? I'd be down for one more if you are. We can do one more. Alright. Chewbacca Angry Birds. It's funny. I think that was a game, wasn't it? Like, Angry Birds? I think I have like a 360 game like that. Ooh, he got second. <laughs> Xbox Series X gameplay on PS5. No, 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 you're reading it wrong. Xbox Series X gameplay multiplayer. 
Brackets PS. Five. <laughs> so if you think about it, the PS Five is like a separated thing. It's in the brackets. You got to do the algebraic equation on. You got to get the Series X on the. Uh, I just love the comments we get on it. I should do it for every stream. Right. <laughs> yeah, it's just so funny. Even when you do uh. What's it? Your Steam thing you ordered. What was that called again? Steam Deck. Yeah, the Steam Deck. You should throw like Xbox and PS5 on there too. I mean, you can kind of do the cloud streaming. Would make sense. Hi there, Skywalker. <gasps> we dropped 200 frames. 200 frames, Kevin. What will we do? Regroup and. Re up I don't know. Oh. <laughs> <sighs> I upgrade my card while we're waiting. Upgrade requires ray level 24. How do I get to a high level? We need another player. Last player. Rovio removed all old Angry Birds games from the store. Probably the licensing's done on a lot of the stuff they use for that one. The end of the dynasty. Who are we missing? We need one player on our team. Take these guys. Two players need oh for Can't do just do two on two here? Right. Be back out. Cool we'll joy. Could do that. Uh... Alright. Admiral Skywalker. Asking you a bunch of questions about the flight. Huh, like like I said, I, I didn't get like any sort of email about it, and I was a little surprised because it made it sound like you were going to write email, ask these, answer these questions, and just popped up that I saw. No idea, but yeah, make sure you do your you know, the questions and everything, get your feedback in. It's important. Did you back out too? You were in the lobby thing? Yeah, I just. There we go, I'm in. Takes me a second more. <laughs> Last gen. Last gen. Thought everyone like longer loading times. <laughs> loading times give you something to do. Yeah, I've been full a great temple. We literally just quit out of this. I bet quitting out of it meant that people were able to. <laughs> Now we need five Same players. Logging, everything. Ooh. What the hell is this? I really want in here. You've got to be kidding. Oh, the boss is in here. Are you in here? Doug the Hammer's in here. Where are you at, man? There you are. Just loaded in. We got a full squad. Now we just got to wait for a team to fight. <laughs> the full, wow. Artphilia? I thought you were a Skywalker. Even they didn't want to be Skywalkers. Ooh. I feel like it's all been a lie. Once more, the Sith will rule the galaxy. <laughs> will they have peace? No. <laughs> not if we're able, not able to find people to fight. <laughs> I mean, we are at the light side. So technically, this is exactly what we want. <laughs> oh my god, I didn't know you could rotate the model in here. Yeah. You can only do it on a swivel, though. I can't, like, take a look at, like, weird angles of her body. Makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> Think we'll ever get a Mace Windu in a game again? I doubt it. I'd like to. I bet Mace Windu, Pretty like, cool, I, right? I bet Samuel L. Jackson has license to. Yeah, I bet he owns his, his look or whatever. His likeness. I, I bet he owns his likeness. We need one goddamn player in a galaxy far, far away. What? <laughs> Imperial Sergeant. Oh yeah, we'll do one more match. It'll be fun. It'll go easy. <laughs> we'll have a great yeah. time. Just waiting for us to get stomped in this one too. No, just... Gotta do the starship crap. Unbelievable. We need something like one other person. Gotta be people. 
No, it's like 2 a.m. Hmm. I, I never looked. Were we getting the triple XP? Yeah, it was triple XP. Yeah, it was cool. Yeah. All the XP we needed. That's why I was like, good time to level up these characters. Hmm. Getting a next gen version of uh, Warzone. Good. Are, are we like? Oh, we're starting. We're starting, guys. Nice. Watch the next like three, four COD games include Warzone. Oh, Warzone's like the thing that like glues them all together. That's their like prime directive. <laughs> Great stands, Ray. Great stands. Use those needs. It's a runner stance. No. <laughs> oh, when you grow up on the desert planets of Chuku. As a nobody, but actually a Palpatine. Somehow. And become a Skywalker. Somehow. <laughs> <laughs> Watching like, like 10, 20 years, they'll here. bring her back for like episode 10 and just be like, no thanks. Right. <laughs> I mean, she's actually like a really great actress. I just think they just oh, she a is. horrible job with the character. I thought it was funny when those movies were getting mad, mad perspective. It was like, oh, it's because it's Ray, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, oh, man, like, give her a story. She's a great character. Great right? Character, yeah. Great actress. Just... Nothing know what to, to work do. with. Uh... But I know what to do with you guys, and that's make you like the videos so that people can check Ooh. out. Question stuff, great donations, cool, subscribing is awesome on Yavin. Yavin Volt. But Yavin the fourth one. Didn't even bother naming. It's like Yavin 1, 2, 3, 4, done. done. <laughs> I've embraced the no notification. Are things better now? <laughs> I don't get it as annoying, but it's also like I miss a lot of info. I'll get out of here with this. I nerd oh so crap. I need to trying. think how many like life forms on Yavin 4 were just living life, not realizing how close they were to getting blown away. Like, was... I mean, that's a lot of things, right? Right, yeah. <laughs> I really wish we could be boss giving up. <laughs> How are you doing? Remember when Darth Maul couldn't block? No. No, that was a little like early, early. Eh. Darth Maul couldn't block. Memory, you think? Gotten everything I need to know because this in battle from. Whoa! Are you gonna s give it a send off? Like this? Is... Oh. No. <laughs> to I just got to yeah. So it's just the way of things. Uh. Yep. I'll probably still do like retro battle. But... I mean, we, we, you know, like I said, we'll probably do it again like around Christmas. I just like maybe a lot of other things to go off. Yeah. Especially as we do some pre-battlefield hype, right? Oh yeah. Hardline's gotta have its date. <laughs> I was just sitting there waiting. Yeah. When will you play me, Sky Captain? No. <laughs> now, tonight's the night, Kevin. Hardline. Alright. Ah. I'm like fighting Bosk on these like temple steps. 
And I got killed by his mist thing. Like, my mist thing never killed It's ridiculous. For <laughs> the Republic. Give us a good... For the Republic. For the Republic! No, I don't know. That was great. That was, that was actually top notch. Was it? Oh, that was fantastic. What? Was it just like the simulations? Okay. It's more enthusiastic than the simulations. Ever. <laughs> oh, I just got my ass cut into shreds by purpley out Kylo Ren. Damn. Took off the muscle shirt and he would... Why did they always talk when he had his shirt off? It was so weird. Always. Dude, put your robes on. Right. <laughs> I'll always remember when he took off his helmet first in the theaters and me and my buddy like giggled. <laughs> oh. Great actor though. Oh yeah, no, good actors. Not a menacing Sith Lord look. What a terrible ending at Walker Store. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. What a piss poor story. I remember seeing this one video of George Lucas talking. He was like, I don't think there will ever be any movies after the original trilogy because you know it's a story about the Skywalkers. It's literally the Skywalker tragedy. And it was like, oh, you poor simple soul. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, he did write 789. I would have rather had his films come to life. Right. The Legends works and all that. Oh no, no, like, there, he actually did no, pen uh, some things. I was gonna dig into the, like, how the Force works and stuff. Oh really? I don't think it would have yeah. been great, but I think it would have been maybe better. Uh, more FPS boosted oh. games. So do I. I love the money the FPS boosted games. <sighs> what can I? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, into something with cyber. Yeah, still waiting for cyberpunk update. Been a while. Those ones. What's cyberpunk doing? doing? I don't like. It's it sold decently, all but it's not what they expected. It, I really love. I just remember super hype, and then all I heard was people like, "Oh, it's not that good," and then it faded into nothing. <laughs> like, like there was a huge wave of like just growing hate me towards it. And, yeah. But you know what's funny is every time I put out a video for Cyberpunk, it's hot as hell. People love like the patch notes and stuff on it. Hmm. You know, for a game a lot of people don't care about, they sure watch a ton of <laughs> stuff. <based laughs> on. Want to know about it? Uh. Yeah. Looks like two. Ray. He's the chosen one. Get again. Bosk in his minds. He's a champ. Jex just got home for the end of our stream. That's rough. On Yavin. Today's videos were a flight sim tour of Tokyo. Pretty cool. And Left for Dead 2 characters in Zombie Army 4. What? I know. Exciting, right? <laughs> That's it, guys. That is the end. See you in the future. Ooh.